So last we left off with the bronze toads. Uh, essentially, all you guys did was um, travel throughout the city of Priest. You explored some of the shops, um, hating some of the names more than others. You heard of some various locations such as um, the Gobble Inn, which is supposed to be a rather interesting tavern. And the apparently there's a fortune teller. Uh, there seems to be a lot to this city, and it's probably a bit odd for some of you, as you've been in Direwood for so long that you're used to just desolate, you know, empty locations. But you know, having such a bustling, bustling streets and people dressed in fine clothing, it, it seems like a really stable place, which may be a bit odd for some of you. Um, we will return to the Bronze Toads. As you guys have made your way over to the Gobble Inn, uh, which is supposed to be not the nicest tavern slash inn, but apparently that's where it's at. So you guys made your way there. Um, you're currently waiting to either give word to the uh, to one of the Prishan officials about where you'll be staying the night or get word from them. Uh, your directives on that were not entirely clear. But, as you make your way toward the Gobble Inn, there's a big sign with a very roughly carved goblin face hanging off the side of a building. <laughs> and, uh, sorry, Eden's chatting already. Uh, that directs you inside. And it's a rather large building. You've heard that it's not the nicest place around. So that's a little surprising. And as you walk in, you're greeted with several, several sites I'll describe before I pop you into the actual Roll20 map. Firstly... It's a huge place. There are maybe a dozen or more tapes, probably more than a dozen tables. There's a, it's relatively busy. There's maybe also a dozen or more people here. Uh, the sm there smells immediately of fresh meats and something sweet uh, that's hard to place. And immediately on your right, as you enter in, there's a table kind of sectioned off fr from everywhere else where there's a goblin in like a big blue cloak, a little oversized, sitting. He kind of eyes you up and down as you walk in. And a very big man, a hulking man, uh, who's kind of just washing washing a dish, sitting across the table from this goblin, who also kind of looks you up and down as you walk in, shrugs and goes back to what he was doing. And uh, the other thing that catches your eye is the center of this large building is a large circular rug. And... On that rug are two giant cushions next to two empty bowls. And on those giant cushions lays a sleeping brown bear. What's up? Oh, thank you so much. You ready? Cool. So, that is the sight and the sounds you guys are greeted with as you enter. Other than that, you just get a... Okay. From the, from the large man sitting immediately adjacent to the door. I will now bring you to the map. And here we are. Well, then I don't see you. Are you are you broadcasting? No, you will not be able to see me. Um, Copy that. Roll, I, for some reason, we went over this before. For some reason, Roll20, uh, it recognizes I have a webcam. It recognizes it has access. It recognizes I want to be uh, broadcasting video, but refuses to do so. I have no idea. Gotcha. So I'm broadcasting the stream instead. Sorry. Cool, cool. No, it's all good. But anyway, as you guys walk in, you're greeted with also the sound of a rather bustling tavern. It's um, it's rather busy, and you guys are have arrived at the Gobble Inn. What would you like to do? Uh, fuck. Bitch. Can I go to the bar? Of course. Is there anything to drink? Yeah, I would. Uh, I'd have a drink. Yeah, if you guys want to step over to the bar, Zilfer is eyeing the place up and down. You can imagine he's looking for some way to cause trouble. Um, but he follows you guys for now. I imagine if you guys are heading over to the bar, uh, Bess will probably follow six. And as you guys head over, a uh, rather a little large for a goblin um, with a tuft of orangish hair off the back of his head um, in rather fine clothing, clothing walks up to you guys. And, he's, and, and he, uh, he walks up, hobbles over to the other side of the bar, looks up at all of you. Hello there! Welcome to the goblin. I'm the goblin. <laughs> what can I do for you? I like this guy. <laughs> I hate Holden. <laughs> can I get a? Can I get a whiskey? 
and a plate of food. What kind of food? Assorted. Some kind of fish in there, some for a moment. steak uh, in there. Fish, fish steak, we got fish steak, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Probably yeah, some veggies. Yeah, yeah. Uh, you should make it two steaks. Two f fuck it, two <laughs> steaks, yeah. <laughs> yeah, we can do that. Uh, the rest of you. Am I hearing uh, the same thing yeah. all around? Something stiff and a plate of food, great. Something stiff, Which can I great. surprise you? Um, yes, yeah, I'm yeah, sure yeah, you can. Yeah, 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 okay, okay. <laughs> there's, there's to you. Zelfer says, oh. Uh, um, do you have any eggs? <laughs> um. <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I can, I can get you some eggs, I suppose, is that all you want? Yes, please. Uh, can I have right. an egg too, please? Uh, all right, another egg for you. Yeah, eggs, steak, fish, whiskey. Eggs My around. specialty. All right, all right. I, uh, that's going to run the whole table. Uh, you egg, can't get the egg, 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 yeah, egg, 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 uh, and for you, the uh, open chest with the with with the tats. That's gonna be uh, my specialty. And uh, yeah, it's gonna run you seven silver. Good to know. All right, all right, everybody. I think we can handle that. Mm -hmm. And Zelfer will pay for the eggs. Oh, thanks, Zelfer, for getting everybody's breakfast. Well, he's just paying for him and Bess. Thanks, thanks Zelfer. After after he names everything off, um, Percy's gonna look at him and be like, "Can I just get a uh, a tankard of water, please?" He looks at you, looks you up and down. Sorry. Yeah, big guy. Isn't you're sure you to eat? Isn't it a little um, early in the morning for that? The weather actually. Um, water water's for now is fine, man. I might come back for something later. Fine then. All right, I'll have that right out. Uh, Boris, fire up! He kind of he hobbles off and walks into a back door. Um. You guys, you have a you have a moment while all that is being prepared for you. Probably tell Zelfer to get a message over to Lara. Oh, Lareth. What what should I say to him? Tell him where we are. Tell him we'll be at the Gobble Inn. Okay. okay. He uh, goes and sits at a table by himself and kind of takes out his jar that has an eye in it. He says, "Don't worry, Angus." Angus, yeah. No, <laughs> don't worry, Angus. I'm here with you. And he takes a moment to cast Sending. I believe he has Sending. Let me see yep. here. Go to his spells. Yes. Yeah, he's going to cast Sending. And I guess you guys don't exactly know what he's saying, but I will mark that off. Something along the lines of, you can respond to this message. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but you hear, yeah, he, he's, he's quiet for a moment. But then you hear, at the very end, you hear him go, Oh, you can respond to this message. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Anything else you guys would like to do? Or you can wait for your I'm back. Oh, I'm back. Um, is, there, is there music in this establishment? Not currently. Well, there is now. Uh, oh, God. Six is going to do attempt to uh play out a tune on on those bagpipes there he's going to be really um on the bagpipes? Uh, impressive yes yeah this is uh something he's been practicing slowly uh but hasn't really performed for every, anyone yet so okay. uh will you take performance i think i will <laughs> <laughs> and the performance oh, jason's gone for me just reconnect Same. he disappeared for me just reconnect if you go to your settings and hit the reconnect okay. button at the bottom he'll pop back up Hit reconnect at the bottom. What? If you go to your settings, the cogwheel oh. at the top right, and scroll all the way down, there's a reconnect button. It won't disconnect you from roll twenty. It'll just reconnect the um, webcams, and you'll be able to see everyone. Oh, no, I okay. Can't see have fucking player at me now. Yeah. Yeah, it's a little. Can you fucking... me? Um, real quick. Please? Yeah. Yeah. Today, coming out of Blaine High School, um, Ew. I saw a girl wearing a hentai hoodie. Nice. And was the kid the got us. And I had, I had gal. Yeah, no, it was a girl wearing it. No, but was it that a, a head gal? What? What? Hi, Jason. What? A H E G. Yeah, whatever. 
Oh yeah, no, that's what it was, but it was literally the entire sweatshirt. I thought it was a Hagao. It, it is. I, I don't Ahegao. know. But it's not a Hagao. Anyway, so at this point, your guys' food and drinks come out. <laughs> Yay. And, um, as, as the party is sitting there talking about hentai. Yeah, as you guys are talking about uh, pornographic images, um, the goblin and, um, and his cook kind of hobble out with a couple of plates. And Sam, it is a, it is a fucking nice dinner. It's fresh steak, a hobble fresh goblin? fish. Uh, all all the drinks, everything looks pretty good. Uh, and now you get the idea of what that sweet smell was. Uh, Six, as a large tankard is placed in front of you, and the goblin looks up at you and says, That's my special brew I've been working on for quite some time. I hope you like it. I down it. It's strong and very sweet. Tastes like all right. kind of like a, like a really strong honey mead of some sort. I tell him it's great. Yeah. You down it. All right. So, uh, a moment passes. How did they cook my eggs? Your eggs are over easy. Fertilized. Mm. Oh, and how was my performance? Oh, that's right. I didn't see that. I don't see the check. Oh, I never oh, saw it roll. Perception. That's weird. You didn't uh, even roll that. Performance. There. There we go. <laughs> Why? <laughs> so. As you aren't too practiced performing this for people, as your food is being made, you pull out the bagpipes and you kind of warm up a bit. Mm -hmm. And you can see some people are... It's not bad. You've been practicing, but, like, you're definitely only warming up. You're not playing anything. And some people seem a little annoyed. You're getting some looks. And then the food comes out and you're like, oh, okay, maybe maybe, maybe later. All right. Yeah. That's fine. <laughs> yeah. So, you guys have your food. Your drinks are good. And after a few, after a couple of minutes of just relaxing in the bar and getting a sense for what's going on, and there are people talking, uh, you're getting some looks. Uh, you're not super well dressed compared to everyone else. Most people here, they appear to be. There's a mix of common folk and you know people of a higher esteem, um, mostly human and elves as well. Other than the two goblins you've seen now. Um, you're getting some looks uh, with the vaguely matching outfits and just a strange lot coming in. And after Does anyone seem to notice who we are or know who we are? Make a perception check. Yeah. Okay, Sam feeds his pet. I feed Sam. I feed, I feed well, Sam, Sam to feeds his, his pet. Yeah. <laughs> And then six oh, feeds me while I feed Sam. As far as you can tell, it seems to just be, you know, you're just getting some looks as newcomers. Okay. Nothing too out of the ordinary. All right. Now, after a few minutes of relaxing for a bit, um, a young half-elven man rushes in into the tavern from the entrance where I'm pinging now. Um, he looks around, and he go and he looks at Sam. And he's like, I, I are you um. Are you the D Direwood? Yes. Oh, uh, here. Uh, and he rushes over, hands you a little piece of paper. And says, um, thank you. And he rushes off. I read it. Um, as you hold out the paper, it simply says, You are to speak tomorrow, several hours after dawn. For the gen General Assembly of Priests, please be prepared. Questions will be open. Okay. Questions will be That's open. What like, we'll have to mean? answer people's questions? Yes. Open to the public. It looks like it was very quickly. It's like, it's rushed. It's kind of hard to read. It's a public forum. I love it. So, okay, this is epic. Several hours after the rising sun of the sun, you will, you are scheduled to speak. Though, there's nothing about the Pathfinder, as was discussed. Oh. Mm. What's on? <clears throat> um, does anyone seem to know where he is? Probably getting See? ready to fucking TPK us. Okay. <laughs> I guess. Uh, all right. Now you read this, and you guys are aware that you are to speak at some point early tomorrow. Um, the the goblin approaches you again. Yeah, so how how's the food? How's everything? You like you like my you like, you like my drink? How how we doing? Can I do anything else for you? 
we get a so far so good. Rooms. The rooms. Uh, yeah. How how many we do? We got one, two, three, four. Right, right. How many how many rooms? We got six, five. Uh, f- uh, five. Yeah. A room for each. Uh, I don't want to be alone. Okay. Four. You can stay in my room. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> you can have the bed. That's... Damn, I didn't know that uh, Six was into fucking rats. You would be surprised uh, for... if Six is into for... No, I, I wouldn't. He is based on me. Yeah, exactly. That's I, I wouldn't be surprised at all. <laughs> four, four rooms for you is gonna run. Let me go. Yeah, check the light. He opens up like this big fucking book that's like... Probably looks like it's almost too, like, too heavy for him to carry. He poof, slams it open. Uh, we got this. Uh, the uh, I can, I can do four rooms. Uh, it's gonna be three gold each. I okay. Give him three gold. Okay. Are you I give him three gold too. Again? I'll also give him three gold. Zelfer looks over. Make it two gold. <laughs> and, the go- <laughs> and the goblin looks over at him. Uh, I, I, sorry, we're a little booked up. Uh, I can't, I can't really do any discounts right now. Two and a half. Uh, I, uh, mm. <laughs> and Zelfer's gonna roll a persuasion check. You're playing him so well. <laughs> right. Okay. Goblin, oh the goblin God. looks up at him. Zelfer just. And Zelfer pulls out the glass jar and just kind of strokes the jar with an eye in it. The guy was like, uh, Yeah, you know, I think we can find. Yeah, two, 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 <laughs> two gold, five silver, that. <laughs> thank, thank you. Thank you. And Zelfer hands him the money. Money? Money, money, money. Money, 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 money! Where can I see Percy? Son of a bitch, Percy. What? Can't Does see. Does he need to refresh his thing? He might have to. So. You guys are secured rooms for the night. Flashy lights too, but you can't see them. I don't think those are lights then. No, they are. They're just behind my desk. Oh, so you can actually see them. I just can't see them from this point of view. Yes. I understand. Sorry. But if I do that, look at that. I like it. I wow. like it. Colors. <laughs> yeah, everybody's gone for me. You are also reconnect to chat. Yeah, yeah, just do the reconnect. There we go. There you are. All right. Hey, 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 buddy. Hey, buddy. So, you guys have food. You fed your pets. You have rooms for the night. And you've received word that tomorrow, several hours after dawn, you are to speak in front of the General Assembly of Priests and be open to questions. What would you like to do? Um, take some time to write a speech. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I assume. <laughs> Um, Sam yeah, six would actually be there. Sam's not a talking man. Sam's brother was a talking man. Sam would want to go up to the to the room. Okay. Sam's probably gonna go to a church real quick. Okay, so Sam's gonna go off on his own to find up. Uh, didn't you already go to the one that was for um general worship? Uh, You're just gonna go back. To spend some yeah. time there again. Okay. Yeah. Absolutely. So, Jason, Percy what is that? Percy is also going to retire for the night because he is not feeling good. Percy is modeled after me, IRL. <laughs> Jason, what were you just holding up for us? Please say dildo. Mean? Please say dildo. <laughs> it was a bottle of That's a lot of ketchup cocaine, and mustard guy. mixed together. Chustard. <laughs> a lot of cocaine. A so- lot of cocaine. Uh, most it's of you... not. I thought it was a box of vape. <laughs> it's, so... it's the lid to a fast food. Oh. <laughs> Thanks. Best and Six, you Betty. guys head up to your room. Six uh, starts working on a speech. Um, Zelfer is going to head up to him. <clears throat> Zelfer is also going to... Actually, no. Zelfer is going to stay down in the tavern for a little bit. Oh, God. Who knows why. He you says, do. Um, I'll... Um... I'll catch um, up with you guys um, tomorrow. Um, um. <laughs> I'll have a speech as well. Don't worry. Oh, no. 
Who wants to touch my eyeball? It's free. Does, did he actually send you a speech? Nope. Don't worry about it. Oh, no. Don't worry about it. Uh, oh, no. So, Percival, you're retiring for the night. Sam, you are heading out to the general worship area once more. You guys are heading to your rooms as well. That just leaves Zelfer in there. So you guys aren't going to know what he's doing. So. Oh, Beth would lay down on the floor. I can't. You can have the bed, Beth. No. I'm fine on the floor. I'm comfortable here. Thank you. I just, Hi. nope. <laughs> All right. I will she, not. she falls asleep right away. Um, God, I stay up a while I'm trying to work on my beach. Holy shit. Okay, uh, I actually have to roll something for Zelfer. Don't say that. We wake up to a fireball erupting. Claire, you want to know what I forgot again? What did dice? you? Oh, do you need me to bring your dice to you? <laughs> God, you oh, you're such it? a bitch. Hi. Hi. How are you? I love you. He's I miss your bitch. face. I miss your face. It's actually, it's that's sweet. That's not really whatever Holden said it was. He said it was it gay. It absolutely is gay. I mean, it, it could be, very, but it's not necessarily. It's, no, it's, it's gay. very homosexual. Hmm. I don't know. You see, Holden's white. Claire's also white. That's pretty gay. I don't know if we use the same words for things. It's the Seattle thing, it's probably. Gay. Roll this we need to get you caught up on your lingo, Jason. I guess so. Oh god, okay. I guess so. Alright. Good to know. Can you not say oh god I, after yeah. you roll? For yeah, something? I don't... Holden, you say things out loud that you need to keep to yourself. Don't worry about it. Well, I'm a little worried about it because of the oh god part. You can't really say that after you do that. Especially when you're rolling for Zelfer, of all people. You can't say, oh god. Wait, no, actually. He, I need to roll, I will roll actually with his character sheet rather than my physical dice. Um, so, he's not going to get a nat one on that. Oh, oh god, it might as well have been. Okay. <laughs> okay. So... Again, uh, things, things that you should keep to yourself. Why is he rolling a fucking sleight of hand? Don't worry about it. That's not shit that I want to uh, see. <laughs> Sam, is there anything in particular oh, you would like to do at this general worship area? Or are you just yeah, commuting? Yeah, pray to my god. Okay. Yep. It is very similar to before. I don't remember before. <laughs> For the first time, well, this is the second time now, there is a connection. But do you remember the Alamo? Jesse, I hate you. <laughs> no. So there, there is a connection. Though you don't get anything in response, per se. At least your lines for, open. But you don't feel as though you're being for his, uh, I was asking for his presence in the coming fucking trials. Okay, um, secret secrets. As you're kneeling and praying to your God, you don't hear any words, but you feel a series of emotions that, in a way, convey words. It's something you sense, almost. It's just a simple message of, I never left. Oh, thank God. You stole it. <laughs> no, yet, children. Buddy. Children. Oh, children. Yeah, I mean, no that is also cool. Hold on, missed out on the first part. We're talking about the tastiest um, life part of a human. Okay. Penguin? Children. Huh? <laughs> when the human is ripest, I should say. What about a human rapist? No, no. Oh, oh my god. god. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking Jason. Go to bed. <laughs> For 
first of all, okay. both sub both both things were equally wrong. To be fair. Hold on, I'm trying to open your stream, but it says you got T O S banned. <laughs> Okay. So, uh, Sam, I, I assume you returned to your paid-for room. Yeah, I'd probably stop by Six's room to see if he could help me figure out what to say. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Come on in. I've been working on my speech all night. Hold on. Can you go into your settings? There you go. We're good. You just you just yep. fixed it on the stream. Yeah. My, I, I mentioned uh, my buddy might be guessing eventually. I think he's working on his character right now because he just like hopped into the Roll20. Oh. Is he watching me eat nachos right now? He very well could be, yeah. Is, Is he watching me eat nachos right now? You're welcome. Yeah, it's my buddy from Perkins. What? Perry the Perkins? Yeah. Perkins? The handsome Perry. He, he, so. Yes, the very handsome Perry. He, he may be guessing Whoa. at some point, just Perry so you guys know. Yeah, he hears that like every day, six times a day. Anyway, uh, Six and Sam were talking about... I hear it too. I don't know why. My name's not Perry. Wait, did we already long rest? No. Oh. It's, Please yeah. do not long rest. I'm long resting. Fuck you. <laughs> so, I just well, asked. what you gotta do, buddy? You gotta speak from the heart. That's what I'd say. Or, I'm just throwing this out there. Lie through your teeth. Huh. I'm not a liar. I'm also not. I know a you're not a liar. Person. That's that's. So maybe we work on embellishment, not lying, but uh, making the small things that you say sound bigger. I don't know if that'll work. My penis. Neither do I. I don't know what to. Do. What what do we even talk about? Well, I plan to talk about. Um, I was essentially uh, born the day Direwood died, and uh, I feel a little bit responsible to bring some of that back. I was born before Direwood was a thing. That's true, and yet here you are, probably took some sort of telephone booth time machine, <laughs> uh, and and here you are with us, so it's it's fate, right? You're here to fix Starwood too. I don't know what to talk about. Hold Have on, you I probably thought should have about... asked, uh, Probably should have asked before. But I'm gonna send you a message on Discord. Okay. Let me mute myself. So Would you rather just go to Secret Secrets quick? Sure. What's up? So, what would the, what's the word for it? What would the relationship between Direwood and Priest be when Sam was originally alive? Because um, I know that they brought him, they presented him a weapon and a shield. Mm -hmm. uh, it so was what was the actual relationship? Mostly a trade relationship. They, they established a caravan with you very early on, um, recognizing... Uh, your combat prowess and taking that plot of land. Um, there wasn't any official alliance or anything, but it was mostly good. You, you know, tr very uh, pretty bountiful trade. They were they were much larger. I mean, not as large as they are now, of course, but they were. You know, uh, they, so would you say that they essentially helped Direwood? Yeah, they had, they had a they had a decent part in Direwood's upbringing. Yeah. Okay, I can probably roll with that. Yeah. Take Thank you. Yep. Hey there. Whoa. Hi. Jesse, we can still see every word you said. Nice. Now we know all your secrets. Ha ha. I don't think you do. Secret secrets. But you have a tiny penis. That wasn't even a secret. I, I didn't even hear that. <laughs> I mean, I have a tiny dick. It's not a secret. Oh. Okay. It's public knowledge. 
Holden knows. Holden's seen it. So as for the gay, the role play you guys were just doing. <laughs> the gay. <laughs> the gay. I tell him thank you, and then I go to my room. Okay. I bed down. Sure. All right, buddy. Good luck. See you in the morning. No pressure. Kingdom's counting on it. <laughs> no Sam, pressure. King. Sam, maybe for the first time in a while, get some butterflies in his stomach. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you guys have no idea how large this audience is going to be. And what's going to be made of? Sam's like, wow, 700-year-old butterflies. You and you cannot... You cannot smoke that. Can you hear me? Okay, so... um, Am I hearable? You guys all yes. bed down for the night then? Sleepy Please sleep. do not take your long rests. Oh, okay. oh god. So, as you all find your rest for the night, you slowly drift into your usual sleep states, dreams, lack of dreams, nothingness, whatever comforts embrace you at night. Take hold as they normally do. But when you awake, the first thing that hits all of you is the cold ground you're now lying on. Then the smell. It's a strange, musty smell that assaults your noses with elements of rot and decay and then sulfur. And as you open your eyes and gauge your surroundings, you lay side by side on a cold marble floor. It looks familiar, but it's different. Uh, upon further inspection, you defi definitely recognize this place. You're back in the Grand Hall of Priests, but you're not. How could you be? You just fell asleep. It's different. The marble is darker, the entire place is empty and clouded with a strange fog that seems to hang driftlessly in its place. As you begin to rise and take stock of each other, the only thing that grabs your attention is a light that pierces the fog. A glow that comes from the direction of where you remember the assembly hall is. And a voice, one that seemingly uh -huh. emanates from the glow, speaks to you. Uh, how nice of you to join me, Toads. I've been waiting for this opportunity for some time. Like a snake slithering through the cloud bog, I've approached you slowly and carefully. Never seen, never heard. Now is my time. The hunt is on. I am the snake, and you lowly Toads are my natural prey. Come forth so I may consume your life forces as you struck down my sisters. Come forth, come forth, and meet your end with grace. This guy thinks we're actually frogs. <laughs> Harry the platypus? Aren't you? No. We are. Is that you, Zelfar? It no. can be. <laughs> How much money you got? Uh, Sam walks forward. Soon I shall have all of yours. There's oh, a there's snake light. in here. And you're going to walk forward toward the light? Yep. Sam's, uh, Sam's walking happen. forward. Fuck it. How far? Sounds like it needs three stepped on. Uh, however far I can, I guess. Come as close as you'd Before like. Before I get stopped. Okay, you walk 10, 20, 30 feet. I'm gonna just get a bog through the, the enormous amount of traps he's laid and just fuck him. Yeah, why not? So, <laughs> now would probably be the time to point out, as I summon my sword shield, that uh, I don't have armor. <laughs> oh. Because Holden is a fucking cunt bag, and he decides to do this with my arm. Oh yeah, we went to bed, didn't we? No, you've not. I don't have any armor either. Though. Uh, smile. Where's your armor, buddy? Actually, get Sam... the blacksmith. No, yeah, you're right. You don't have any armor on. Um. I don't even have my thing. Okay, okay. just armor. checking just yourselves quickly. You have everything you would have had on you when you went to sleep. All of your equipment, all of your weapons, tools. Fuck is that noise? It's Jason messing with a cap. <laughs> you have everything on you, but Sam, you do not have your armor. Uh, you guys watch as Sam just starts walking toward this light through the fog. Uh, mm -hmm. Sam? Yep. I feel like that might be where he wants you to go. I don't know. That's where else a would bad we go? idea. Bad idea, I don't Sam. Know. Bad it is, idea. it is a terrible idea, but what else are we going to do? Well, you can move the other way. This feels like one of those like one-sided things. 
I don't know. Do you guys want to see? Hey, hey, Percy, are you standing out in front of the door? Can you walk out? Um. I try to walk backwards. You just start walking back, and you it feels like you hit a wall where the open doors are. And you hey, look it's back, a wall. and it's just a black cloud that stops you. Predictable. It's, it's like a dream. <laughs> I like it. the uh, I like the idea you're going with, though, Sam. Uh, no armor, straightforward. I'm gonna I'm gonna do that too. So not by go. choice. I feel very okay. vulnerable. Do you walk up next to Sam? The rest of you? Sure. I am hiding behind six. What are you do? Just sitting on our asses. Zelfa is gonna say, um, well, um. we. I don't like this, Mr. Sam. I don't know if that's the best idea to just, um, um. Hey. It's not. However, it's, hey, the, it's the only thing we can do. Mr. Glowing Light speaking at us. Who are you? Oh, you know who I am very well. Do we? For it was you, Zelfa, who killed my friend. Well, I've killed a lot of people. Uh, who is your friend? Probably a lot of friends. I was your friend, Angus. I nudge. <laughs> I nudge Samael and I go, Zimmer, you. Mm, Wait, I don't do know. I, I don't think it? Zimmer had a friend. Do you he not remember how you first knocked out my friend and burned him with a fireball? Zelfa does that to everyone. Showed him no mercy? Ah, yes, but it wasn't just Zelfa. V. He was the one that knocked him out. Mm, I did do that, yeah, he was being a dick. Was I here <laughs> so... <laughs> do, do you even know who he's talking about, Six? I believe he was Thanks. talking Stop about... Uh... Oh, fuck you. This is my fault. One point of clarification, it was not a fireball. <laughs> it was a fiery potion you saw poured into... I have no idea what's going on. Yeah, I Sam honestly would not. This. Would best? No. Well, oh, wow. maybe, kind of. If I wasn't here for this, can I go? I'm rolling a history check. You know what? Go ahead, Percy. Roll a history check. Because I'm... Wait, they, Isaac best speaks need to do that too? Isaac doesn't have brain right now. I asked the I'm gonna do it. person if I can leave, because I, I had no part of this. <laughs> no. This doesn't apply to me. <laughs> Nobody can leave. <laughs> Nobody can leave? Why not? It's pretty selfish of you, dude. Are you going to feed us? I'm yeah, hungry. I didn't kill your friend. I don't even think I was there. Because I had no fucking idea what you were talking it... about. I'm trying to think of who it was. Was it one of the trolls? That we cut the dick <clears> off <throat> of and stomped on? Percy, <laughs> you, you're no, not sure. No, because I was there for that. Bess, however, do you recall specifically this glowing light entity said first you knocked their friend out and then burned them? Bess, you were on Six's shoulder when he knocked out one of the hags. Tossed her over, punched her over the side as she tried to escape of this giant tower. And then Zelfer poured oh. a potion that burned her alive. Oh. Her. That one. So you finally okay. remember. Wait, I look at oh, I'm like, Jesus you. Christ, dude. That's harsh even for you. Hey, you're gonna fucking come here. And do this shit to us after you feared me down 13 flights of stairs? As far as times. I know, you've entered my domain. As far as I know, I went to bed towards... because I felt like shit, you asshole. Look, we're all just gonna have to agree to disagree. Um, just get us out of here, would you? Sam raises his hand, kind of waves it a little. I wasn't, I wasn't here for this. Can I leave, please? Time to go to bed. I got a big day in the morning. What you got going on in the morning? Oh yeah, the speech thing. <laughs> I also oh, yeah. kind of want to go pick up my armor, okay. if that's okay. You guys, uh, I need best no. six and Zelfer all to make dexterity saving throws. I will make it for Zelfer. Funny. The asshole that caused this isn't even here to watch us. Okay. <laughs> yeah, what the fuck? <laughs> How do you roll a saving throw? Uh, you go to your kids. It's under... You go to your Jesus Christ. It's under core stats. I go stats. to my... Blah, blah. What? Your core stats. Oh. Ah, okay, thank dexterity. you. And I also need one from six. Uh, mine's there. Uh, right above Claire. No, it's not. No, it's not. <laughs> 
Okay. I'll try again. Hi, Perry. <laughs> Hi. Perry, I haven't okay. been to Parkers in a while. I haven't been able to tip you okay. lately. 20, 20. Well, you should come in, man. I don't live down there anymore. anymore. You hear above you a rumbling <laughs> and instinctually jump five feet forward out of the way. Bess and Zelfer are going to take seven points of bludgeoning damage as a section of the ceiling falls on top of them. And they, they dive out of the way, but they're still going to take some damage as, as rubble hits them. Ah! And with that, I think Careful. we need to roll initiative. Oh, you do. <sighs> Wait, how much did I take? I'm sorry, I haven't. Seven bludgeoning my damage. Um, <laughs> I will roll for you, uh -huh. Harry. Uh huh. I said none of you can leave. You must all pay for what you've done. What do you mean I all? I haven't. I did happen. nothing. <laughs> you got quite the uh, associates. The god complex, there, buddy. Yeah, what the fuck? Did you? Do you have a dollar value on this, or what's going on? There is no dollar value. Money means nothing to me, as long as I can get revenge on you. So I'm not it, sure you understand. Yeah. Maybe payment. we can just apologize. I'm not sure if you understand what revenge means. For me, it's just murder. Just murder me. Oh, we're rolling more initiative. More and more yeah, murder. I you to roll initiative. Did mine work? Uh, nope. No. Here it is again. There it is. There it goes. Oh boy. Okay. And now I'll, I'll add all your modifiers at the end here. But I just need everyone like, to roll their initiative. Stand off to the side while you do oh. your thing. It rolled my other one. How do I roll initiative? Roll initiative? How about that, Mr. State Guy? Can I just watch? I'll provide you some constructive criticism on how best to kill Zelfer. How do it's I roll in... initiative again? I'm sorry. It's I'm on the course back. I'm killing Zelfer if you please. Just... What was that? If we Snake help you man? kill him, do we get to leave earlier? I'm tired. I really can't. Here Who's speaking? I'm typing. Percival. And Sam. Okay, before we proceed with any more RP, hey. can we please, let's get this initiative going. No. Clara, to roll I'm your initiative, speak. you select, you, you highlight your character, and then yeah. you go to your character sheet. Yeah. And then on, on character sheet, on the core stats page, uh, right yeah. by, right below your health, there's a big initiative button. When I do that, it says a roll command looking for the value of a selected token, but no tokens are selected? You gotta so you have to your click token. your character first. I don't... Uh, just, just oh, have, yeah. Do you want me to roll a d20? No, I already rolled your initiative for you. Just okay. make it easier. I know you're not familiar. Hold on. Do you want to do it for me, too? I can't. It... Sure. I'm doing what I... You're all good. Oh, wow. That's uh your initiative. So, best is going to get that. Okay. Uh, Percival, what's your initiative bonus? Seven. Seven. Selfer, because of I alert. His. Yeah, fuck that thing. Uh, six, what's your initiative bonus? Uh, si five. Five. And Sam, what's your initiative bonus? Just leave me at one. It, it won't make a difference. You're correct. Okay. Let me just reorder this quick. And then Zelfer, then you. Okay. First up is six. You can use... you Combat... We're in initiative, though combat oh, is mm -hmm. only sort of initiated. That's up to you guys. But... Um... This glowing, so that's him up there, eh? Yeah, this speaking glow cloud from up ahead has somehow knocked the ceiling down behind you and made you jump out of the way. There we go. I stopped there. Okay. And? Um, You're just rushing forward? I rush forward. Uh, uh, yeah, I don't say anything. I'm strong and silent. Okay. And you're going to rush forward. And as you do so, a series of little black hands reach up to you from the ground. Racist. And they start grabbing and clawing at your ankles and feet. And you're going to take six piercing damage, or slashing damage, as they do so. Well, alright. Are you gonna ignore his comment that you're racist? <laughs> well, I should specify they're more like a dark gray, but <laughs> and you and you just hear this right. this this very muffled and terrifying shriek from beneath the marble floor. It's just as they as they reach out and grab at you. 
Is that terrifying? Well, well, well. I mean, I can make it more terrifying if you'd like. No, the first one sounded like uh, someone motorboating some titties. <laughs> okay, six, like a merlot six rushes from... forward okay. through the fog. Adhemar, it is your turn. All right. So I'd like to approach... Who is this, Percival? Uh, Which one are you going six. for? The one closest to you is six. In my trap, yes. That's yes. Me. Six, all right. So I'd like to go right here. Do you have the speed for mm -hmm. that? 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40. That's 45. Uh, what's your movement speed? It's 40, isn't it? Uh, yeah, let's see. So you see. can get Hold there, on. which is still within melee range. Okay. And then I'd like to cast a Paralyzing Grasp. Go for it. So right. what I need so you to do is you need to uh, roll 1d20. So slash roll 1d20 mm -hmm. plus – so you're rolling the hit right now, and your plus is – plus 9. Jesus, fuck. So – Just slash roll 1d20 plus 9. Is it the plus symbol yep. or what? Plus symbol. What the fuck? Sorry, guys. Not a word. You're fine. Okay. Um, so just slash roll one, number one, D number 20, plus nine. Plus is in the symbol or plus? Plus the symbol. I'm pressing that. Yeah, you just tell me. So there, it's that. That's what you're typing in. But not the not the word slash, like the physical, like the actual slash symbol. Yeah. Physical slash. <laughs> yeah, I'm doing exactly that. Okay. Are you putting a space in Oops. between roll and one d twenty five? No, should I be? Yes. Like slash roll space one d twenty plus nine. There, there we, we go. go. That's uh, six. I think that might hit you. That hits me. Okay. Now doing the same command, you can roll your damage. All right. Well, not not like the same. Not, that's not. No, it's you're, you're, using you're the same command, man. I said using the same command format. Uh, <laughs> okay. Uh, Take fifteen. It will. No, you do not. Um. You have it on your D&D Beyond. I believe it's 3D8. Okay. Yeah, so now you're rolling slash roll space 3D8. <coughs> Six, I need oh you to make God. me a constitution saving throw. Okay. Six, you are, six, you are taking 14 Ooh. lightning damage, and for the next round, right. you are paralyzed. You feel the lightning course through your body, and you are stuck in okay. place. Your muscles tense up, and you reach out to punch, and you cannot move. Got it. Okay. Anything else, Adamar? Uh, let's see. How much more can I do? Uh, you've used your movement. That's your action. If you have a bonus action you'd like to use, you can do something with it. Or you could maybe say something quick. Let's see... Um, I'm fucking angry. Why you kill my sister? <laughs> uh, I don't believe I have anything else to do other than uh, allow you guys to approach me. Okay, Bess, it is your turn. No, it's why are you there? Wait. Because I was able to roll, and I don't think you noticed when I finally did. I'm sorry. No, I don't know what you were originally. I think you were an 18. You I got a 12. You... Well, no, originally you were. I rolled for you, so you're there. Bess, it's your turn. It's me yeah. now? Yeah. Hmm. Did I see Six get fucked up up there? It's difficult through the fog, but you you hear piercing screams, and you hear Six kind of go, Argh! as he uh -oh. tenses up. So you know something's going on. Oh. Did you just say, oh? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> 
have I'm looking for where my movement speed is. Um I have movement speed of forty. Um uh, if I dash that would be my action, correct? Mm-hmm. How far would I get with my dash? Mm, you would get your you get your movement on top of that. So if your movement is thirty, with your dash you make it sixty. You my mo my there. movement is uh is. Your movement is. Forty. Your movement's forty. Then with a dash, it's eighty. You'd make it there. Oh, cool! Can I get up there to him? Oh, okay. Can't go that far. Okay, I will do. Then. Up Where the there. fuck is my room so cold? Jesus Christ. Why are there so many arrows going on? Whoa. Yeah, I don't know who's doing that. So you're going to run up to I him? Have... Yes. And that's my action, correct? Yep, it's your action to dash. So would it? Would I be able to use a bonus action? Yes, ma'am. Uh, let me look, let me look, let me look. Um, 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 um. Um, Jason, we see you. I'm sorry, I'm still learning how to use roll 20, so I'm like, Bleh. I am gonna use. Do I have healing word written in here? Is that in here? Um, sorry. Holden, do mm -hmm. you see healing word anywhere in my in my spell book? I'm not. I should have it, right? You should have it. Healing words. Uh, that's a first level spell. I don't see it in your. You, you have your D and D beyond it. Healing word. Uh, who are you trying to healing word? Uh, six. Six. Okay. So healing word is one d four plus your spell modifier. Yeah. So. Me, yeah. Uh, you don't have your spell modifier marked down. So. Uh, that should be um, your wisdom plus. Uh, I think, I think it's, a, it's a four. four. Oh shit! I th I think I'm sorry. I'm. Roll one d four plus four to heal six from afar, and, and mark one first level spell slot. <clears throat> How do I do that? Uh, specs or slash roll. Slash roll one d four. One d four. Say. Saying it's an unrecognized command. Um, Did you do slash roll space 1d4? Okay, six, you're gonna heal up for there eight points. She max heals you as she rushes. So, <laughs> I think we're gonna take that eight. Thank you, Bess. So she rushes forward. Thank you, Bess. And from behind, you, you feel this radiant energy hit you in the back as it, it, and it moves down to your ankles where your piercing damage was. Okay. And, she, mm -hmm. and now, Bess, you can sh see. His ankles are like wrapped up by these strange gray claws, and his body is just tense and looking at this strange shadow shadowy person. Thank you, Percival. Um. So this is big bad guy, right? Appears to be big bad guy. That would be me. <laughs> that would be me. <laughs> <laughs> The big bad guy says from across the room. <laughs> this is big bad guy, right? Yes, it oh is I. God, big why bad. is he so fucking far away? <sighs> there we go. And I summon my black blade. Okay, you summon That's your blade it. as you run forward. And as you do, you are going to take as you ram through. But I'm not. Does it count as difficult terrain? Nope. Ah, oh, damn. You are taking ten slashing damage as you rush as you run forward and you feel your ankles torn apart by hands that Dude. emanate from the ground. Kind of hot, not gonna lie. Okay. Would uh, you sleep on a bed of hands? Um, if they felt me up, I would. 
So then it's going to be Zelfer's turn. He's going to... Oh, actually, I need to check the range on the spell. I'll be right back. I need to go see if I can find a heater. Let me see. This, the range I hope on you this find spell. a heater. I do hope he finds a heater. Where is it? You know what? He's going to cast... A witch bolt at at you. You could render millions of multi polynomials on your video card, and that you could heat that up, and that would just toast your room for you. <laughs> I tell Zofer that he fucked this. He better unfuck it. Okay. Uh, does a sixteen hit your AC, Perry? Seventeen. Seventeen. It does not. So Zofer rushes forward a little bit. He moves forward, seeing that everyone's kind of getting fucked up, and he lifts his hand, and a cackling bolt of energy launches from his hand, and actually, you, you just barely, you cock your head and barely dodge out of the way. As it a cackling <laughs> bolt or a crackling bolt? Because one goes, ha ha ha, and the other goes, mm. a, a laughing bolt that goes, ah ha ha ha, I'm a witch. Perfect. <laughs> it zooms by him. <laughs> That's what I was hoping and for. And, and, and as it misses, Elfish goes, fuck. <laughs> Sam, it's your turn. <laughs> I just move. Welcome to the party. I just move. You move Same forward with the hands coming from the ground. Hey, can we, uh... Can I just go take a seat and, like, avoid all this? <laughs> I had no part in whatever it is that you're mad about. No? Good talk. <laughs> oh, sorry. You can respond. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> no! No one's allowed to leave. I will have Why my revenge you? on all of you. You're not having revenge on me. I did nothing. You're just had getting revenge on that guy. For me, it's <laughs> just, uh, you're just killing me just to kill me. Kill me, killing me softly. Mm. Okay. Whoever's, whoever's next. That's going to bring us to six. You're paralyzed for the round. Yeah, I am. Um, but as, as you kind of you force your body to move forward and try to punch him, it releases. Next turn, you have yours. Uh, though you did start your turn in the trap, so you're going to take uh, five slashing damage as they continue to slash at your ankles. Copy that. Okay. Then, Adamar, it is your turn. Okay. So you're going to put a darkness spell on Zelfer, you said? Yep, so... And what is the range on that, or the area? Uh, that would be a 60-foot area, or a 60-foot range. Yep, you're within range. And... It says 15-foot radius. 15-foot, okay. Yep. So, Zelfer is shrouded in complete darkness now. And then... Can I cast a dominate person on... Uh, is darkness an action to cast? Yes. Is it... Um, I guess I would know. Yeah, one action. Okay, so I probably can't do that. In that case... Um, you know what I wanted you to do? Yep, okay. <laughs> Did you say what you wanted do to do? <laughs> No, no, no. <laughs> you know what I want to do to do. What I want to do to do. Sam, you watch as the... the. Hold on. How do I grab this? Oh, no, it won't. Uh-oh. Stinky. Oh, I, I don't watch. I actually I, I made a bit of a suck, suck. here, but I can fix this. 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 All right, so Sierra. <laughs> yeah. Oh, minor oopsie, but I, I guess can... I guess I'm not watching as whatever... Yeah, you're not watching because nothing's happening yet. I'm, I made an oops, but I can fix it. It's fine. Uh, this is good enough. This guy. Sure. Uh, Sam, you watch as one of the benches starts floating above your head and then is hurled into the darkness where Zelfer just was. And your thunk whack. Ow! Why don't you roll <laughs> that 1d20 plus 9 again? To hit him? Z Actually, Zelfer? Can you see through the darkness? Since it's your spell? Um, if it's just the regular darkness spell, no. No? Then you have disadvantage, technically. So I need you to do it twice, and you take the lower... Because you cannot see him. So do okay. it once more. 
Chief. Get back to it. Okay, yeah, you're gonna hit. Uh, <laughs> why don't you roll 3d6 damage for me? Okay. As you guys watch it, Bench is hurled through the fog. And you hear a pull as Zelfer is hit by it. Now, does, he get knocked the out of the, does he get knocked out of the darkness? Though? Not quite. Okay. I imagine a flying bench smacking you would probably send you flying. Well, it didn't do that much damage. Okay. Got it. Okay. So there's now just a, a bench just fucking <laughs> in halfway in the darkness there. Uh, Bess, it's your turn. Coolio, I um, would Cleo. like to use my moment to... Sorry, I'm like trying to split my screen so I can see my character sheet and all this business at the same time, but it's really not working. So I'm like, ah! Six. ah! I want to get to six, please, if I can get there. Easily. Okay. Sorry, I'm having a real hard time on the laptop here. Did you move me for Good me? Because I can't see anything yeah, now. You moved you next to him. Back. Oh, fuck. I'm gonna murder roll 20. Uh, before you get murdered in roll 20. <laughs> oh, oh, I have a heater now. It's nice. Damn. Life is good. I'm going to cast Spirit Guardians, which I know I have in here. I just have to wait for it to load so I can get to it. Okay. Okay, how do I cast it? Why is everybody going away? <laughs> Suddenly I can see no one. Jason, you're the only one gone for me. Hey, how do I how do I cast spirit guardians? I don't know how to cast a spell. Oh, there we go. Oh, there we go. There's a little button. Click it and stick it. You don't have the stuff selected on it. Uh, okay. Do you know how to mark off the spell slot? Because that's what matters. Effects. Yes, you I can use D and D my... Beyond for the description and everything else. I just need you to make, keep track of your spell slots. Where would you like the spirit guardians to go? Um, or is that the one that's centered on you? It is centered on me, but I'm standing right next to uh, six. So, um, um, uh, right, I'm back and forth here. Okay, and that is a fifteen foot radius, I believe. Yes. Uh, also, it's a con concentration spell. Uh, I'm going to call forth spirits whoops, to protect whoops. me. Um, they have a distance of 15 feet for the duration. Um, do -do 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 -do. Wisdom saving throw on a failed save. The creature takes 3d8 radiant damage or um, on a successful save, half as much. Okay, so you have spirit guardians in this range. Yes? Um, let me go back to that. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Maybe. Yeah, yeah, that's good. Yeah. Is that correct? Yes. Okay. Okay. So now there, there is there are spirits hovering around you. Okay. Um, that's not gonna have any effect this round. It looks like anything else. That's it. Okay. Uh, Percival, it is your turn. Um. Big Mac, thank yous from McWampies. I'm going to walk up. Please show me your exact path. <clears throat> yeah, show me your exact path, too. Oh, wait. No, I'm going to go through here. Can I attack him from there? Yes, but I... So, is that still your path, though? Yeah, straight three squares. It's three squares forward. Yes. Okay. Good to know. Yeah. And then... Go ahead and make Wampy. Big McDankies from McWampies. Okay, I know the twenty, the sixteen does not hit him. The twenty-six does. So he's gonna oh. move forward, and he slashes you across the chest with this big sword. And you are going to take that fifteen damage. That's for one flight of stairs. <laughs> <laughs> you would remember that during your fight with him in the tower, uh, he was affected by several spells and basically got to the very top of this tower and then was forced to run down, back down the tower <laughs> several times. <laughs> Just running back and forth and back and forth. <laughs> okay. That's going to bring us to Zelfer, who's going to 
move out of the darkness. 15, 20, 25. He's gonna get out of there, kind of holding his head like, "Fuck me!" Uh, and he's gonna hold his hand towards you, Percy. He's gonna say, uh, "Mr. Percy, fuck him up, please!" And he's going to cast enlarge. I'm gonna fuck him up. Here I come, fucking him up. <laughs> so you uh, are now. Things I love to do. <laughs> fucking him up is on there. Whoop whoop whoop. Big Percy. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm Percy. You are now Percy. Twenty-five cents, and you can meet God. Have you ever wanted to see something so beautiful it couldn't be put into words? For 25 cents, I will kill you. Thank you. Okay, so that's Zelfer's turn. Welcome. Sam, <laughs> it's your turn. All right, my exact path. Yes. Here, 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 here. Here, here, here. You are technically moving through Percival's space in that path because he's big boy now. Can't run under his fucking legs. His big boy legs. Can't you pass through uh, no, ally I think territory? Actually, ally is non different. Yeah, you can do that. Never mind. Yep. He runs underneath my legs and just. Yep, I like it. He crouches down a bit. <laughs> under your I, legs. I do a nice little slide. Yep, epic slide, and you get up. And swingy, swingy. Swingy. Mm -hmm. Swingy. Both are hits. That's 19 damage as you slice through him twice. <laughs> Some of that is necrotic. Mm -hmm. I think that's five total necrotic. Okay. That, that's it. Okay. He won't let me leave, so I'm sorry. I don't want to do this. Could have just let me leave. All right, six, it is your turn. And as you're starting your turn in the trap... That is only two slashing damage. Okay. Wood. Two slashing damage. Wood. Never mind. Okay. Um, wood probably never mind. Yeah. If I had to guess. I'm gonna go pee real quick. Okay, I have subtracted my hit points. Um, <clears throat> I guess, let's see. Uh, the dude's standing there, but I'm in a trap, so I assume I'm going to get some sort of, uh, negative or, or whatever, um, disadvantage. So, I guess I will try to escape from the trap. Okay. Um, as you start, I'll, I'll just tell you, as you start to move your feet, like, carefully, like, oh, how do I get out of this? You notice that as soon as you move your feet away from the ground where the hands are coming out from, they stop going after you. So you imagine okay. it's just a it's just a matter of moving away from it. Okay, um, oh, I will go ahead and plant. I will go ahead and do that. Uh, let's see, looks like I can go basically there. Yeah. Uh, that appears to be a flank as well, so I'll mm, take my it, advantage. It is not. Is it not? There's oh, nobody. Right. No, no, nobody adjacent. You guys are just all on one song? side. Are you able to hear that? Hear what? Hear what? Good. Okay. Six, what are you doing? Are you going to give him a, the I'm, good old one-two? I'm giving him the one-two. I'm pulling right. up the uh, pulling up the one-two machine. Sure thing. Uh, yeah. Come on. Come on. Weapons. There we go. Um, I guess I'll go ahead and make... What? Oh, they used part of my movement, so I only get one attack. So I will just make it a good one of these. 23. Uh, it, I, is anyone else seeing it? I don't see anything. Hit. I do not well, see what, what did you roll and what's the damage? What did, you roll? what did you roll and what's the damage? I rolled an attack, a knee attack. Yep. Attack was tw uh, 23, 15. That'll hit 15 damage. damage. Yeah, uh, no, damage is 8. Okay. So as you, as you move out of these creatures, whatever they are emanating from the ground, you pull your legs out, and as you do so, you whip your knee around and right into his back. Crack! With your knee. And that's going to be eight bludgeoning damage. There you go. None of them. <laughs> yeah, that's maybe the sound he makes as he gets, you know, fucking kneed in the back, in the spine. Yeah. Percy, we can't see you. Just reconnect. Whenever you can't see someone reconnect, and if you can't see yourself, then maybe you need to reconnect. Anyway, uh, is that all for you? Yes, that's me. Adamar, it is your turn. Alright, I cast Dominate Person on the large guy. 
Okay. Uh, is that a wisdom saving throw? Yes, it is. 17. Percy, roll that wisdom saving throw. <sighs> Hooray for two more fucking games of not being able to play. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. so, yep. Percy, as you're this hulking mass, you look down at this thing you're about to squash, and he looks up at you, and these pierce his eyes go black. And they pierce you, and you feel him enter your mind. You are, I need to double check the um, dominate person, but you are now essentially under his control. How many turns is it? I'm um, checking right now for you. Um, each turn, ba -ba -ba, you can use action. Total and precise control of the target until the end of your next turn, the creature takes only the actions you choose and doesn't do anything that you don't allow it to do. During this time, you can also cause the creature to use a reaction, but this requires you to use your own reaction as well. Uh, each time the target takes damage, it makes a new wisdom saving throw. Um, so um, you have you have this per you have Percy completely under your control. Congratulations, um, Holden! You get to ad lib something real quick. Okay. Uh, can Percy still speak? Mm, can no. he think for himself? You are battling. It's like you're battling someone else's consciousness. You can think. Yes, but speaking, you're not allowed to do anything that you're not told by this, so you can't speak out loud, no. Uh, then, to myself, I think very loudly, Slisky, take over. I don't know what's going to happen. Let's find out. Ha! Huh. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> this is... You can't dominate me if a demon's dominating me. <laughs> I... Oh, uh, okay. Uh, let's do this. Let's do this. Um... <laughs> Just you take the wheel. <laughs> Let me check something. I'm gonna look at something. Take uh, it from his hands. Um, 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 um. Actually, here's how we're going to do this. Adhemar, I need you to go to your skills tab. You make a wisdom saving throw, bitch. And I need you. <laughs> you know what? No. Go to your core stats. I need you to make. I'm gonna have both of you make intelligence saving throws. To see whose consciousness wins out. Rip, rip, Percival. Yeah, fucking, I'm big dummy. <laughs> oh. Oh my oh, god! god. Yeah, wow. Okay, so your consciousness is. Oh my your, your, god. Both of your consciousness are in Percival's brain, fighting over who gets to decide what's being thought. Percival, you just barely eke out the thought. Slisky, take over. And then you're dominated. You will find out what happens soon. <laughs> Good. Oh god. I know my target. <laughs> for the time being, oh. <laughs> for the time being, uh, what command do you give Percy? Uh, I was going to give him uh, attack. Uh, gosh, I don't care. Try and do like an AOE attack against these three. Okay. Lol. I have a sword. <laughs> Please, Big sword. I don't know. <laughs> okay, best it is your turn. You see Percy kind of like grabbing at his head. He's struggling with something. Yeah. I'll be right back. Um. The one time Percy's not super dumb. Dude, a 19 versus a 20, that's nuts. And you both rolled the same second throw as well. That's nuts. And you both- You- Oh my god, the only- You you both literally rolled the same two rolls, but your modifier is one higher than his. Since this Epic. is a concentration spell, I cannot cast other spells, correct? You cannot cast other concentration spells. You can cast any other spell that is not concentration. Um, I'd like to use my cantrip light. Okay. And I want to put it... Oh, it has to be an object. Um, Put it on my shield. The floor is an object. My mom's an object. My face is an object. Do my I have to touch the object? fucking dick to is an object. Yes. You have to touch the object to put the. Uh, does it have a range? Does it have a like a like a? Sorry about that. Um, one object twenty feet. That's what I have written in here, but I can check. Well, is that twenty feet of light or twenty feet away? You can put the light. I don't. I am looking it up right now. Okay. Twenty feet of light. That's a really long light. <laughs> I have to touch it. Okay. I'm really sorry. This is hard on just a laptop, you guys. I promise I'm not just being cutsy. 
Um, I don't believe you, Pots. You're a good player. Punch your face. Okay. In playing, I won't enjoy it. Getting punched in the face is my kink. Doesn't matter the gender. Duly noted. I'll see you soon. <laughs> Who's standing right in front of me? Is that Sam? Thanks, Sam. Jesse. In, yeah, that's Sam. In between you and this bad guy is Sam. Does Sam have any weapons on him at all? He's holding yes, a sword. in my hands. A sword and a shield. Can I reach to touch his sword? Sure. And cast light on it? Yeah. In hopes to blind whoever Perry is? Okay. Is it light or just day- is it just light or daylight? Light. Okay. It's a 20-foot area? Yes. Okay, there's now light... We'll just do this. There's now. I have a super glowing sword. Your your glow your sword <laughs> is glowing. Saber. Your 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 sword is glowing more than usual now. Ah, <laughs> uh, the light. That's cool. Okay. Anything else, Bess? Um. You think if no, I no travel, hard? will the fifteen foot radius for my spirit guardians travel with me? Um, I believe it does. Let me double check. I know super September. I believe it does. Go with yes for now. Yep, they flit around you to a distance of 15 feet for the duration. Can I move where Wait, the box is without me you? moving? To a distance of 15 feet. Like in each... Oh, wait. Is that 15 feet in each direction? That's what I was that understanding. Like- if they, yeah, they flit around you to a distance of 15 feet. No, your radius is a lot bigger. Oh, let's like change that feet. and have... Can we see if my if my, if my my guardians would then fuck him up? Yeah, they he would. He should have been taking damage for like two or three turns now. And I believe that it'd be radiant damage. Okay. So at the, is it at the start of your turn they do damage? Yes. Uh, on a, let's see. When you cast it, you can designate a number of creatures, blah, blah, blah. An affected creature speed is halved in the area, and when the creature enters the area for the first time on a start or on uh, wait for the first time on a turn or its tur- or starts its turn there for the first time on a turn. Yeah, you know, I'll give you one. Yeah, yeah. So that's three d eight radiant. Yeah. Uh, why don't you roll that three d eight radiant damage? It's slash roll space three d eight. Yes, ma'am. Correct. Okay, Adamar, you're going to t- you're going to take that fourteen damage. As a uh, a barrage of tiny, what do they look like? You, what do they look like, Clara? They are your angels. They can look whatever you want. Um, two giant fucking dicks just circling the air. Two this massive is fucking guardians, right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. I think it already has uh, what it's supposed to look like written out. It's to be. Oh. You call forth spirits to protect you. That's all it says. <laughs> Oh, if you are good, their spectral form appears angelic or fey. Your choice. So I'm going to say they can look like whatever you want in any angelic form. Let's. Oh. A demon. Um, Wait, no. They could be they a fu- could bunch be of fucking fiendish. rainbow evil. pooping unicorns for all I care. Kitten fists. Pick that one. Bunch of kitten fists just flying around. They start pummeling. A bunch of little kitten fists start pummeling you. Oh, animal. I'm allergic to cats. Bop, 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 bop. <laughs> Double damage because you're allergic to cats. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Anything else, Bess? That's well, ironic. A witch it. being allergic to cats. <laughs> <laughs> no. Okay. Wait, that's can all. Can you ask me something? Yeah. Okay. Percival. Yeah, as you're battling in, within your that's mind me. for control and losing. You feel a third consciousness enter the ring. Player three has entered the game. And everything oh, good goes dark. Um, I subconsciously out loud just go, hey, it's a party. Yeah, out loud this bit, it's a party. <laughs> and then he lifts his sword. <laughs> Let's see, I'm actually gonna, I'm gonna roll for this. Ooh, he's rolling for me, I like it. You get two attacks, right? Taking control. Huh? You get two attacks, right? Yes. Wow. Okay. Both are going to Adamar. Uh, Thank God. I thought I was about to die. You were about to get hit, but uh, based on my rolls, no. 
How much am I taking? So roll those two attacks, Percival. Oh, I thought you just said you rolled them. No, I just rolled to see who you're going to hit. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. And gotcha, you gotcha. got him twice. Whoa, just that's by sheer luck. What I was going for. Oh, uh. that's in that one. That's Okay. Neither hits, actually. Wow, nice. Get Probably on. because of never controlling this body before, the, the sword swings you know, very cumbersomely. That's not a word, but... Oof, oof, <laughs> that is a word. Cumbersomely? Sure, that's a word. I want to believe yeah. that's a word. That's a word now. Um, it's been a word for a while. <laughs> I fucking love Jason. Fuck you, Jason. <laughs> <laughs> I have a dictionary. <laughs> okay, so you, so you just... You very clumsily swing twice to no effect uh but why'd you change the word um does the sword grow to match me i think it does would that make it do more damage it increases the size category of the weapon so yeah um i mean enlarge reduce increases i mean it doesn't matter on this turn but is it a strength or dex based weapon strength if it's a strength-based weapon, I believe... I mean, it's a great sword, so... Let me double-check. Uh, Unless they change the rules for sized weapons, generally yep, there's a different modifier. Everything you're wearing modifier. and carrying changes size with you. Um, uh, let's see if there's enough room, blah, blah, blah. You have advantage on strength checks and strength saving throws. You also grow to match. Target deal. Oh, yep, your your weapon also deals an extra one d four damage. So roll two d four damage yeah. on top of that. Well, no, you didn't hit either one. Yeah, I know. So it this matter. turn it wouldn't matter. But, but just, just but, good enough. Yes, you do get an extra d four. Uh, Zelfer gave you. It's it is Zelfer's turn now, and he's gonna go. Um. Uh. And he's gonna move over here to target. And he is going. There's to, a target here. Yep, there is a target here. Um, he's going to cast Scorching Ray. So he's going to. Throw three of those out there. Boom. Nope. One, two, three. That is two hits. That's a lot of fire. Okay. So you are going to take... Yep, as, as a scorching ray of flame emanates from his hand, you're going to take that 14 fire damage. Is that any, like, residual or anything? What's that? No, you're just taking the fire damage now. Yeah, you're on fire now, and you burn for 110 oh. per turn. Per everyone else's turn. Ouch. Okay. Per everyone else. That else's. is going to be... <laughs> That's going to be Zelfer. <laughs> Sam, it's your turn. His turn. Doesn't matter. You burn. Fuck you. <laughs> um, <laughs> after seeing Percy, I'm kind of... Right here. Uh huh. And swing. I'm running away as Percy, far as possible. Because yeah. Percy scares me. Yeah, you don't have advantage. You're not flanking technically, but yeah. So you swing twice. That is a 22 and a 20. Jesus fucking Christ. You were rolling well tonight. So, that so that's is 24, 24 damage. total damage. Six of that being necrotic. As you slice into his side. Yeah. That is, oh boy. You guys are okay. Okay, okay, that. Anything else? Or are you just slashing them? Um, dude, can can I like just go home, please? <laughs> <laughs> Send me you back to my room. I can leave. If you wish to leave your friends to die. Sam's like, I don't give a fuck. See ya. He's like, bye. <laughs> See, yeah. I think they can handle themselves. Where's the downside of this, though? <laughs> Like, I'll, I'll stay for another round or two <laughs> until I start getting beat up. Then I'm gonna leave them. Uh, okay, that's it. Okay. Uh, then six, it's your turn. Uh, I step by. Whoa, that didn't work. I step. Hello. Uh, where are you trying to move? Yeah, there you go. You got it. I just moved back. Uh, so you move closer to the the swing, Percy. <laughs> Sam moves away. You're like he's like no no no, and you're like fine, whatever. You just move right over. <laughs> I uh I look up at Percy and I go, uh, hit me, bitch, and then I punch the uh, the that, other guy. 
Oh, that was such a so bad hit idea. Hit me, bitch, and then you punch. Okay, go ahead and punch. <laughs> All right. I don't punch Percy. I punch. I punch the. Uh, right. Yeah. No. Okay. I assume. Yeah. Yeah. All right. And. Oof. Okay, that is a hit. Holden, so did I get any um opportunities from them moving around me? Nope. Though? They all stayed within your range. Oof. So nope. Uh, okay. We're smart. <laughs> so you're taking another nine bludgeoning damage from another punch, plot right in the jaw. Nine. Ugh. You know what? Maybe I should... Nah, I'll do this first. That was probably a good my, idea. Is my that, turn's up. Whatever you were thinking. I'm still looking at you, Percy. Okay. I know. You're gonna die. Uh, is that your turn? <laughs> That's my turn. Alright. Adamar. Alright. I choose to cast Mass Suggestion, telling you all to close your eyes. Okay. I... I... Oh, does he take damage because it's the beginning of his turn? He does. Uh, 3d8. Roll it. Yeah. Sorry, Perry. It's all right. <laughs> ah! Wow. You shall pay. Now close your eyes. I yeah, attempt to use your Boros. Hold in. To... To block this spell. Is that a reaction? Can you do that as a reaction? Or did we set it as an action or bonus action? Pretty sure it's a reaction, right? Well, I'm because I, I, I use it to block a spell. Here, let me, let me. I, I gave you a specific. Doesn't say. Anything. Was it a counter spell or dispel magic? It's... There's a difference. Where is it? The target is dispelled. Where, do, where are you looking at? This? Where is? Oh, it, it says you can use an action to focus the shields. It's under my. Class notes. Yeah, it's a dis it's a dispel magic, dispel not magic. it's not a counter spell. It's a dispel magic, so you couldn't do that. That it's it's an action, not a reaction. So not then it's useless. useless. No, it can dispel any magic, uh, like spell of third level or lower, but it's not a counter spell. It's an action to use. Okay, I'm I'm just confused on how I can dispel a spell. When it's not my a spell, turn. a spell that is lingering, or a spell that is in place, not one that oh, okay. is being cast in that moment. Like one that has multiple turns. Okay. Yeah. So, uh, Thank you. as a mass suggestion, you guys all need to roll as you cast this a wisdom saving throw. Seventeen. Yeah. Oh, rip me. Like everyone. I'm not wise. Oh boy. Uh, is Sam within your range? What's the range on that? Mm. Uh, range 60 feet. Yeah, I, I'm not Sam. I meant uh, Zelfer. Yeah, you can get Zelfer too. He needs to roll one as well. All right, everybody. So wisdom get... saving wisdom throw. Wisdom saving throw, please. Oh Why? wait, but because you all are in combat with him, you do have advantage on the save. Okay, great. Um. Uh, okay, I can't find those. Yep, makes makes no change for me. Doesn't matter for me. Yeah. Uh, I believe anyway. Don't don't they? I'm pretty sure. Uh, pursue, blah, blah, blah. Wisdom? Was it, it wisdom? It's 17. I thought they had advantage on the save because they're in combat with you. So far, it makes no difference to literally anyone. So. It does me. Then spell ends, so you can specify conditions, blah, blah, blah. If you or any of your companions... Uh, no, actually, it does not say that. I could have sworn. Is that a different spell I'm thinking of? Maybe that's just yeah, a suggestion, suggestion or something else or a charm. Maybe it's like a charm creature thing. Um, yeah, it says nothing about advantage. I was mistaken. It's just a straight roll. Okay, so Zelfer's fine. And six I mean, either wrong. way, I'm fucked. So. Everybody else, you close your eyes. What What was the, uh, what's the DC? 17. Okay, I got 20. Yeah, I said okay, six, I said six oh, and Zelfer are fine. Oh, good. Everybody else closes their eyes. Is this like a re-roll on your turn type thing? Yeah, it's just a one turn thing. He told you to close your eyes, and that's a pretty quick thing. So your next, uh, yeah. So you'll have so one turn of closed eyes, and then you're back. Okay, so it's one, not even here right now. So turn of eyes. Eyes. Yep. Um, let's see them. 
Can I move here? Yeah, you can. Right, that's not a good. Uh, uh, but six will get an opportunity. Six will take an opportunity to attack. His eyes are not closed. Okay, that's fine. So you'll get one attack. Do I still get to move there? Yeah, of course. Okay. Unless I kill you. If you'd like to make an opportunity good attack, enough. go for it, six. Strike. I am attacking. Uh, yeah, I'll do this one. There he is. Okay, so as you move as you move away, you feel a headbutt on the back of your head. Just thunk, <laughs> as you take eleven damage. Uh, <laughs> thought I told you to close okay. your eyes. <laughs> I did not listen. <laughs> okay. And now, uh, just six. I need you to make a dexterity saving throw. Sure, sure. All right, I can do that. I don't know. I don't know why you're making such a big deal out of it. I can. Yeah, that's fine, dude. Blake, sure about that. Um, Good, it's about time. He's the one that got us into the bullshit. <laughs> I've done no such thing. Bean, if you shut off my computer, I'll end your life. I'm about to end yours so I can go home. Uh, Six, did you roll the deck save? I don't see it. What'd you get? Uh, 15-15. 15-15. Fifteen. Fifteen, fifteen. Fifteen, fifteen. That does not pass the DC. Okay, so... Uh, as he moves away, you headbutt him. Uh, you hear a rumbling above you. And Six, you are able to jump out of the way. As you can see it coming, the rest of you are going to take 32 points of bludgeoning damage, oh. except for Zelfer. The rest of you are taking 32 points of bludgeoning damage as the ceiling caves in on top of you. Six, you dive out of the way over here now. You're Thanks. taking 16. Okay. And as he moves, moves? As he moves Move further, further up toward the, the stage area, Let's see. Uh, could you roll, Adamir, a d6 for me? Asking me? Yep. Great. Just roll one d6. Yeah. Satan? Yes. No, cat. Blake, did you see the ad ad feature that was uh, the jawbreakers? I doubled. Uh, no. For 25 so cents. Only, yes, only Six and Zelfer can see this. Two ghostly apparition, apparitions, like their faces completely blackened, except for little white slits for eyes, appear in the in the assembly hall. Yeah. All right. Um, okay. Uh, Blake, are you in the game? Yes, partially. Okay. So, uh, situation is, you guys all went to bed. Zelfer got into some Pretty apps and some antics in the tavern, and you all woke up in the basically the grand hall, but it's dark, it's foggy. And you guys have pieced together that one of the hags um, is out for revenge and is uh, attacking well, we didn't you. Piece together, she told us. And is attacking you. Uh, kind of true. In your dreams? Question mark. But the pain feels quite real. Fair. So yeah, it does. Uh, you you cast enlarge on Percy. You hit him with a scorching ray, or hit uh, your enemy with a scorching ray. Where is the enemy? I will ping him now. Ah, you resisted his mass suggestion, so your eyes are not closed. You can see what's going on. Tubular. Okay, Bess, it is your turn. Your eyes are closed. Is there anything you'd like to attempt to do with your eyes completely shut? You know, I'm guessing that this probably would have broken my concentration, huh? Oh, you need to roll a constitution saving throw, please. Okay. And hold on, all my spell slots that are in use are up to date? Yes. Uh, you, did, okay. you guys did not benefit from a long rest before you got in this, so you're a bit short. <laughs> And you've Tubular. used a couple. That is just enough, I believe. All right, let me um, concentration check. I mean, a ceiling fell on me. Yeah, no, I mean, no. There's an actual. There's, there's, there's um, reason for that. Uh, equals ten or half the damage you take. Oh, half the damage you take, whichever is higher. So sixteen. So you needed to make a sixteen. You failed. Cool. So the um... spirit guardians dissipate. And I still can't open my eyes yet? Nope. Not for this turn. But you can still try to do something with your eyes shut. Blake, mm. I'll be done next weekend. Okay. I don't know if you can tell from my voice or not, but... Bronchite is gonna fuck me in the asshole. Take your time, homeo. Homeostasis. Well, plus I get paid next weekend, so we can actually do shit. Yeah, I'm, I don't have any money currently. Yeah. 
or access to my money because uh, me and Chris got our cards. Uh, someone got into them, so I am sans money or access to it until my parents send me my replacement debit card. Nice. Mm -hmm. Are we doing cameras right now? We're, We're on doing roll cameras 10. on roll twenty. Ah, that is why I can't see anyone. Yeah. Um, I would like to do. I'd like to cast Beacon of Hope. I love bacon. Um, I can choose any number of creatures within my range, which is 30 feet. Um, for the duration, each target has advantage on wisdom and uh, on wisdom saving throws and death saving throws and regains the maximum number of hit points possible from any healing. That would have been awesome two turns ago. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So I have that. Um, but I appreciate it nonetheless. That is what I will do. That's that's all I'll do. Okay. And that is another concentration spell. Good to know. Thank you. Um, You're welcome. Then, Percy, it is your turn. I need you to roll 2d2 for me. That's a lot of d2s. Hey, Zelfer. Hi, six. Okay, that works. So, six, as you were taunting this demon controlled yeah, Percival, you did that. he walks Holy forward shit. and swing one set six for me, please. <sighs> You're such a dumbass. 16, I don't believe, hits him. Oh, but no. your eyes are closed and you'd have disadvantage anyway. Um, And then for the. Actually, yeah, your eyes are closed, so I'm actually gonna. Roll a perception check for me. Uh, my eyes are closed. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. See what you can see, but I'm blind. And perception is not only sight. I don't have a nose. That is enough. Okay. Wow. I. So then you're going to move forward. Let's see. And that's five. What's your movement speed? Forty. Forty. So that's five. 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. You are able to get within range, and you you just swing where you heard him walk away. You just start swinging in that direction. Roll with disadvantage. Another womp. So the uh, the cool thing, had that guy not pussied out and run away, is if you had missed me there, I could have automatically made Jesus. you hit him with the attack. With disadvantage, oh, that's still a hit for 15 fucking damage. Okay. Ugh. So Damn. that's what I was aiming for there, in case anybody still thinks I'm an idiot. I mean, yes. No, I thought you were still rude. I mean, you said that. I'm a big dummy. See, he he, he no, made you I, think I he bitch. had small brain, but he actually had very big brain. I mean, I just know you're a dummy. That's beside the point six. All right. Zelfer, okay. it's your turn. Oh, cool. I'll get to play. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. And damn it, Isaac, you uh, got in my way. <laughs> um, I'm not even here right now. Swiski has me. Hmm. That explains so. Zelfer can see things. I can. I have eyes. Yeah, oh, you have eyes. You, did, you fuck face. Oof. <laughs> oof. Coming in hot. Someone's angry from work. Dude, I was supposed to be off at nine, but because one of my coworkers is straight up suspended, I gotta stay till nine thirty. Sounds normally, like you wouldn't problem, be there till bitch. nine anyway. No, normally I'd be off, but we had a meeting, which mm. I have to go to meeting. Which you let me know way ahead of time. Yeah, but I'm still pissy because, like, he showed up and they went, oh, you can't be here. Bye. I'm like, I want him here, please. Okay. Is that Wiley? No, Brayden's at 14 points. 10 gets you fired. He's just being suspended. Oof. And he's still pissy about it. It's All like right. hacking on a game server and then getting banned and like, what? Why aren't they appreciating my hacks? Oh, you mean like the guy who got banned from Fortnite? <laughs> <laughs> Topical. I am gonna he yeet a fireball about there. Oh god, I missed Sulfur. Okay. Which would be 20 feet away from Fuckface McDickhead. Yep. <laughs> At what level? The only level I can cast it, which is three. Okay. Uh, it took Blake, what, 35 seconds to cast a fireball? At a roll, a deck saving throw. <clears throat> no, 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 no. Ooh, that's some good damage. <laughs> Holy shit. Let's see. Dicks. That Damn. is enough. So you're only taking half, but that is still a hmm. solid 19 damage. 
As a, as a ball of fire erupts behind you, setting all of the uh, the hey, tables and chairs really behind you ablaze. Mm, let me see. Do hey, I have any you are what an time? asshole is. <laughs> Your hey. fire. Let's see. Yeah, now everything yeah, behind you is you very much on fire. I really need to get some good bonus actions. Oh, that is a ring. That's not what I wanted. I wanted this one. Hi, Clara. Hi, Blake. Hold on, I'm gonna bully you IRL next weekend. I know. So all this shit back here it. is very on fire. It is my kink. Alright, um... Oh hey, maybe you can drive him to work, because I'm gone next weekend. Why are you gone next Wait, weekend? Isaac, so you wanna have... be that one... You finish first, actually, Claire. You're... He was talking to you, I apologize. Oh, no worries. Um, I, I, I have advanced member advisor training, so I'm going to the cities for five days. Wow. So Isaac, you'll be down here the 16th and 17th. Yeah. You just happen to pick days. I'm probably I'm, I have off work. Yes. Because it's Kristen's birthday weekend, so I took the Sunday off. And Wiley went. You deserve a weekend off. And Ooh, someone's it. getting raw dicked. Right. Is it me? Is it me? No, it'll be me when I get down there with Holden. Yeah. Sam, your Apparently eyes are closed. But would you attempt? Would you, what would you like to attempt to do, if anything? Heal myself. Okay. Yeah, you can do that with your eyes closed. So. Can you? Yes, I'm gonna cast a spite, and because because of this uh, well of light thing, don't I get max? No, yes, you, you heal yeah, max. You get max healing. Cool. So I'm just gonna add twenty. Yeah. And then I'm gonna roll a bunch of uh, life dice. How many dice? So let me check and see if. Uh... Eight. I'll roll four. I take twenty damage. Yeah. <laughs> nice. You take twenty damage. Yep. What did you gain? Uh, extra damage. Mm -hmm. So when he healed, so you healed for exactly what you just lost, but now you get extra damage. Yeah. Oh, See, this is this is a this is not an official subclass. Can you explain this uh, ability, please, once more? So I ha I haven't used the other ability yet. So I just have twenty black blood, kind of like just floating around me. Hot. Okay. Currently. Cool. Cool. All right. Uh, then it's gonna be six. Well, be black your your eyes are open. You're good. Uh, what would you like to do, six? That's me. Oh. And please keep in mind we'll when you're moving see. around the map, I need to know your exact path. Alrighty. Here I am. I am taking this path. Five. Ten. Fifteen. Uh. Twenty. Twenty-five. Thirty. Okay. Uh. Punch. Let's go with, uh, this worked last time. Another headbutt? That is not going to hit. Dang! Yeah, as you, as you move forward to do another headbutt, he just pushes your head away with his arm. Alright, alright. That's it. That's what I got. Only one attack? Well, I moved 40 feet, so... Oh wait, no, I can make a full attack. Oh well, next time. I forget how this game's not the played end of your turn sometimes. Yet. All right, I'll just go ahead and uh, make the additional three attacks. Go for it. You know, is that a, that's a key I'm point cool. for flurry of blows, blows, blow, 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 blow. Yeah, flurry of boys. Flurry of boys. boys. <laughs> all of, all of that. I love flurry of boys, man. Flurry of <laughs> boys. All right, we're gonna go with a a, a priest's a, a, favorite what? day. Uh, and then the same knee. And then a shoulder Damn. something. Damn! Okay, okay, I see you. Wow. A whack, whack, whack. Yeah, so <laughs> after he pushes your head away, you use that opportunity to knee him in the gut and then shoulder him in the jaw as he does so. So that is a total of 20, 30 oh. damage. 
Fuck. Thank you. Okay. You're welcome. Edomir, All at right. the start of your turn, uh, the ghostly apparitions that formed are going to move five, ten, fifteen, twenty, 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 Good thing I know that. Yeah. <laughs> it's going to <laughs> Thanks, Holden. <laughs> Listen, Mr. Mr. Two and a half hours late. I don't hey, want to hear that... it. Listen, all right. That, Listen. <laughs> Listen, Mr. I have eyeball. <laughs> Clearly you don't have eyeballs. <laughs> it's going to reach out and try to grab you. This this ghostly. I don't want it to. Um seventeen? <laughs> Well, give me a sec. Can I can I shield that? Is the question at hand? Uh, shield gives me a plus five. That still brings me to a seventeen. So there's no fucking point. Touch me, Dad. Touch me, Dad. Okay, it reaches out. And you feel its hand actually goes through your chest, and you feel it like sucking your life energy away. And it grabs your heart and it squeezes. Twelve damage. What yeah, type of damage? Uh, yeah, that does matter. Let me. It is technically necrotic. Fuck! I'm, I'm resistant to force damage, so 12 damage. You're resistant to force? Yeah. How <laughs> fucking useless. I know, but I get it because of my, my special armor. Oh, okay. uh, uh, no, it's a, it's a force. <laughs> you said it was a force asparatus? Okay. It's a force asparagus? I've been looking at the rules. It's horse damage. <laughs> Not force damage. So he's immune to uh, Tom? He's immune to your horse, yeah. <laughs> okay, Adamir, for your resistant to Tom. Alright. Resistant to Tom. Cast a paralyzing grasp on this man. Go for it. What? Right, roll to hit, so that's your 1d20 plus 9. Okay. Okay, boomer. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, me saying that activated my Google. On my phone. Oh boy, yep, that's certainly Ooh, gonna that's hit. A good hit. Six, uh, so six. I need you to roll oh, my constitution why, saving. Why didn't I? Uh, why didn't I paralyze him last round? Then I could have done that. Oh well. <laughs> Con <laughs> constitution saving throw, throw, please. And Adamir, roll your three d eight. By the way, Sadie found that centipede that's been crawling around. Uh huh. And uh, she batted it underneath the fridge. Oh, that's just lovely. Ooh, shitty damage. Yep. Okay, so six. You are taking nine lightning damage, and you are stunned. You are paralyzed for your next turn. You feel your muscles tense up and lock up lesson. again. Alright. And, you're, and Man, as you think, stop. fuck, I should have done that to him. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you're hey, finally him. a worthy opponent. <laughs> Just hold him. Yes. Isaac says you're live. Hold him, you're live. <laughs> you're both banned. I just. I was even... originally. I was gonna get Perry to do it, and I messaged him, but he didn't read the chat, and I was like, oh. "He's been a little." Oh, yeah, I'm been... tying him up a bit. Hey, hey, Perry, tell him he's live. Yeah, tell him he's live. He loves it. It's his kink. Dude, well then you're live. Oh! Yes. Yes. Did you know? yes. 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 Holden. Yes. Holden. You're not. You're about to not yes. be live. Yes. You're about yes. to be dead. Yes. 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 <laughs> yes. Oh, I, I got through that episode, by the way. Nice. Yes, yes, yes. You're yes, already done yes. with part three. I'm yes, like, I have ball. four episodes left of part three. Fuck yeah. Uh, what anyway, do you think of part two? Part two is still one of my favorites. Oh, Hold it's it, so have good. You, have you gotten to... Are, are you watching, like, Vanilla Ice right now? Vanilla Ice. Cool Barry, ice? you watch JoJo? Yeah, dude. I, Holy I'm caught fuck. Up. New and I read part yeah, six. That fight... Yeah, we just wrapped <laughs> up with that fight. Heartbreaking. Anyway... Uh, I, I was broken. That's all you have to say. I was a broken man uh, after watching Wait, that. Vanilla Ice? He cries watching JoJo. No! <laughs> Isn't that, no, that's not the bird. No. Bird is pet shop. Yeah, um, okay. Void okay, man. Ice. That was tough. Wait, hold on. Yeah, so... Hold on. Look at chat. What chat? Which chat? There's a lot of chats. Uh, hold what? on. No, I'll, I'll just I'll just message you. Yeah, later. We're, okay. Uh, so that was your turn. Uh, anything Hold else on. for your turn? You use your grasp. Oh, I see. <laughs> oh, my laptop just. Oh. Shot. Oh, who? 
<laughs> um, uh, Zelfer. What's happening to me? Okay. Wh which one? Like. Uh... Wait, hold on, hold on. Which one? Which one's? Uh... I'm sorry. Which one of you guys liked, Jojo? Uh, me, and me Isaac... Holden, and Blake. And okay. Jason. 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 I'm not sure what it is. I don't know. Perry, that I'm is. not sure exactly where you want. Probably like here. A, like a big French fry. <laughs> Those are good too, though. So you're. Yeah. I right, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm taking you to the secret <laughs> secret real quick. I'm not. So you, are you moving Zelfer or Six? The one next to you? No, 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 no. I was talking about I envelop myself into a vanilla ice looking thing because of dream magic. Oh, okay. And like go attack Zelfer with it. Okay. You know what? I'm going to allow I, like, this. Can I like cut off his arm because it's a dream? You can certainly try. Okay, I'm going to allow this. Okay, sick. Okay, so here's what's happening. You guys watch... As this, as this creature you're fighting forms into a void of a sphere in midair and then shoots towards Zelfer. I don't like this. He actually did it, that man, and he is JoJo. <laughs> so why don't, you, why don't you roll to hit for that? Your 1d20 plus 9. Uh, yeah. Just know I will not hesitate to fireball myself. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> I'm gonna take that damage, and we okay. will both die next turn. Uh, Zelfer, make a dexterity saving throw. Okay. No, 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 no. So you do not lose your arm, uh, but I need you to roll 3d8 damage again, Perry. Okay. I don't like this game, guys. You're, you're like, the cause of it. Okay, you're taking. How is this my fault? You're taking 60. Oh, you know what? That would be force damage, I'd say. <laughs> So you're only taking eight. <laughs> I'm useful. After, no, after telling good. him how you use <laughs> And then I hand it to him. All right, you're taking eight force damage. Jesse whooshes past you and takes, like, you can feel some of the top layer of skin on your left arm is, like, burned off. I look at him. You're going to regret that, and I'm going to regret what happens next. Oh, DMs hate him. <laughs> Find out why. <laughs> Find out why next turn. All right, well, that's all I can do. Okay. Uh, luckily, it is also oh, before God. the end of your turn. We got 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40. It's able to get here. The other ghostly um, creature moves towards Bess and Sam. Uh, Bess, it's your turn. Okay. If I dash to six again, would I be able to use a spell that is an action, or would I have to use a spell that is a bonus action? Uh, it would have to be a spell that is a bonus action, because your cool. action is to dash. Your dash uh... action. Uh, yeah, sorry, laptop was not plugged in properly, so it just fucking kaput. Oh. Welcome back. We're working on it. Zelfer, if you had low, if you had rolled three lower, oh man, would that have been good? Oh man, oh man. What is it that it's that's advancing on us? I'm sorry. Uh, there's a ghostly creature here. I'm pinging. Hmm. If I had to say, probably a ghost. I would like to. I'm just going to cast Cure Wounds on myself. Treat yourself, honey. Here, let me, get, let me get my character sheet to do this. Sorry, it's hard to be on a laptop. Not enjoying it. Is that level two? <laughs> Only Jason pays attention to the cameras. <laughs> Constantly, it's my job. Okay, boomer. How do I cast Cure Wounds at a higher level on here? Uh, He's a millennial. At a higher level, you would just—you're marking the spell slots off on D and D Beyond, yeah. Yeah. So for well, each level up, so if you're casting Cure Wounds at level two, it's two D eight, three it's three D eight, etc. Okay, I'll cast two. It's two D eight plus four, so I'm just gonna do that. <laughs> Hang on here. I'm sorry. On who? On me. On yourself. Okay. 
And your eyes are opened. It is slash roll. Mm hmm. Slash roll. Number two. Letter D. Number eight. The space between 2D8 and roll. Oh, don't I heal the max? Yeah. Uh, yes. You're beacon of. Yes. Yeah, you can. Yes, you do. Okay. Oh, 22. Thank you. 20. 20. <laughs> I'm stupid. It's 20. So 20. you heal for 20. Yeah. Speaking of hope. Cool. Fucking broken a little bit. Uh, okay. Percival. Let's see. Dominic. Oh, do I still have my movement? Yes, you do. Because I just cast. Okay. Um, what is this business up? I would like to move back 5, 10, 15. Can I get back there? Hey, we're back. Right? What's up, gamers? Hey, hey. Jason, I like it. I like That's it a lot. That's where I'm going to leave it. Thank you. Okay. Um, Percival, I'm going to take you to Secret yes. Secrets for just one moment. So as you are in your own... Yeah, you're, you're completely shut off from your own mind, but you hear a voice. Am I done having fun yet? Um... Honestly, I don't fucking do. Would this person know what's going nope. on? Um, is it dead? No. Hmm. If I let you keep going, can you guarantee you won't hurt my friends? No. Can you make a slight attempt to not hurt my friends? <laughs> a slight. That was good enough for me. Keep going. Okay. Oops. All right. So then, Percy, for your turn, I'm gonna roll. Here, well, since you got that, I will make it this now. You did. You did get him to say a slice. So uh, if this. need be, I will. Um. Uh, it's back to secret secrets for a second. Okay. Sorry, I'm I'm climaxing. Oh no, I'm kidding. Um, here we go. If need be, teleport. I have it. Okay. Got it. If you know how that is. I don't know how much you know about this body, but I can teleport. Nothing at all. Is. And everything. Okay, Oracle. <laughs> okay. Um. Yeah, how far is your teleport? Uh, 30 feet. I accidentally said okay, Oracle, and my phone turned on. Yeah, okay, Boomer activates my... Uh... Then you're okay, going to boomer. teleport. You can teleport to here, I believe. Nice. And then you still have your movement, yeah? Yeah. 5, 10, 15, 20. That is within range. And now you are going to roll... Zelfer, pick a number 1 through 4. 3. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, okay. Um, roll two s swings for me, please, Percival. I'm about to die. <laughs> um, can I volley for a cantrip and then two swings? You're not in control. Yeah, I didn't think so, but I'd volley for it. <laughs> uh, so Zelfer, an 11 doesn't hit you. It barely misses. But, but Adamir, no. 20, I believe hits you. For 19 slashing damage. Oh. He comes every time he gets hit. <laughs> Sorry, Perry. I'll tip you good next uh, time. Oh, hey, thanks, man. Uh, <laughs> uh, okay. So oh, for anybody in Holden's chat who's wondering, uh, he's a stripper. He's not. He doesn't work at a fast food restaurant. That's also true. He does both. Did you mm -hmm. quit Perkins? No, I'm kidding. All right, Zelfer, it's your turn. What do you want to do? Give me a second. Things have I work changed. work at Perky's now. Things have changed. Things have Someone changed. Just, someone's closer to me than I wanted him to be. Hello. Oh, you're too big. <laughs> you're the one I who know. made him big. I, I, I didn't. Um. <laughs> How long is he big? I think it's I, like... I, I, I've been taking damage, buddy. I should have been rolling concentration. Oh, it's concentration, isn't it? Uh-huh. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Roll, uh, roll. Oh, wait a second. It's a good, it's a good thing you didn't add that deep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So roll, roll your concentration check. No, no, no. Roll the concentration check first. With the constitution saving throw, isn't yes, it? Yes, yes. 
Uh, how much damage? Yeah, either way, that's a fail. Yeah, that's a fail, So yeah. you wouldn't get the 1d4, but you still... Fart. The same thing still happened, but you are now small Big Percy. Percy's still big, but smaller Big Percy. Gotcha. Percy big, but not as big as Big Percy, small Big Percy? Yeah, small Big Percy. Yeah, okay. okay. Like medium-sized, kind of half-big, small Percy? Medium-big Percy. Rather mm -hmm. than Biggest. rather than big Percy. Gotcha. Not big Percy. You're not but like big. Yeah, you're not <laughs> Percy. You're medium big Percy. Gotcha. I'm not a <laughs> I'm more <of> like <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm glad we've had this talk. Yeah, I'm glad we got that situated. He is really trying to figure this out. Ah, uh, that's you got, you got thirty seconds on the clock, man. Right there. Okay. Into the wall is a fireball. It's gonna hit everyone but Percy. Okay. <laughs> Hell yeah. Sure thing. Uh, then everyone oh, roll. It's, it's, it's piss damage. Poo -poo damage, but. but yeah. Uh, roll. Yeah. Roll a deck save. <laughs> out of here. Oh boy. <laughs> when when Zelfer passes a deck save. My dex isn't as shitty as you think okay. it is. Uh, and then I just need to roll for this. So You're I think. Tweak. Okay, everyone passes. Everyone takes uh, seven fire damage. <laughs> yeah, it's just a little p on the wall that kind of <laughs> spreads some fire around. Dude, I rolled five ones. Yikes. Oh, my God. That's, that's terrible. Wow, that's a bad fireball. <laughs> oh, no. 8d6. Um, and five of them were ones. Wow. Give me a sec. I think I can get myself away from this. I just have to triple check what if I can. Never mind, just the dash action with XPD is free. All right, um, I'm finna die. So uh, he looks at Percy and he gives a little salute. <laughs> okay, that's gonna bring us to Sam's turn. Yeah, it is. All right. Do you still wish to leave? I am all out of fireball. Uh, why are you scared? No. Um, not at all. <laughs> no, what, just... why, why would I be scared, huh? Eat his huh? ass, guys! I'm there. You barely scratched me. Yeah. <laughs> you can tell by all looking right. at him, you have not just barely scratched him. <laughs> Alright. Here, you want some more scratchings? I'll scratch you a little bit more. No, swing, please. Swing. Or not. Uh, Sam, what was your exact path? Motherfucker, pay attention. Where did I start? Started here? Yeah. I went here, 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 here. Okay, okay, okay. Here. Okay, you're, you're good, you're good. Yep. Okay, two swings. Uh, both are a miss. Come on, Sam. So you do just Let's scratch see. him. So you're, you're yeah, skilled with your sword. Yeah, fucking Zelfer comes back and I miss. Yeah. I haven't missed yet. You're skilled with your Pussy. sword. <laughs> so, but you 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 swing and it just grazes him. Sorry, I'm Pussy. communicating with my big bad. Slashes. How about we all shake hands here? We apologize for whatever the fuck these reasons. Whoa, where'd my camera go? And then, uh, and then we call it a day. Go back to our dreams. I was having a nice dream. <laughs> I was masturbating, so. Okay, uh, <laughs> Six, it's your turn on that note. I take that as a no. My turn, then. Where did your face go? Can you not see me? I just refreshed. So sad. There you are. That means the rest okay, of us have to refresh, right? Um, no, I still see him. I, I see everyone. down there now. I see everyone. Right. I'm gonna go... Five... Nope. Hello? Five... No. Move. Come on, six. You can do it, six. Oh, wait, no, you were paralyzed, weren't you? Oh, that's right. That's right. No, that's why six can't move. It's because you're paralyzed for the turn. Makes sense. Okay. I'm done. So that brings us back to Adamir. Okay. You gonna be useful? Yes. Good. Kill me. You don't have what it takes. 
Uh, I'd like to cast a level five animate object. Okay. I don't like it... this anymore. Take it back. <laughs> and then I'm going to make ten of the benches around you guys come to life. Okay. They, they kind of look like giant mimics from Dark Souls, I would assume. Did you, like, but, with, but benches. That, no. Okay. In order to do this, this is stupid. Fuck it. Uh, I have to get rid of the fog, which is really lame, but fuck it. It's still foggy. It's actually, fog. it's, yeah, it's, it's actually hard. It's actually what? The ghost, the ghost things. It's harder to see them without the fog than it is with the fog. Grr. Okay, fine. It's still foggy. I'll just do this. Good. I will just do this. Can't you put the benches on top of the lair? I can't. The 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 smoke layer is over the benches, so I can't touch them without getting rid of the smoke. So I'm just going to pull out a bunch of benches. Fuck it, you have ten benches. <laughs> just the ones around perfect, you, I presume. Perfect soldiers. Uh, I was just gonna say like these, this kind of like circle, square, Four, whatever you wanna call it. Five, six. That's me. That's you. <sighs> I, was the I don't. I don't. I don't like Eight, how much larger nine, the benches on the ten. right side are compared to the benches on the left. <laughs> Hold yeah, it! I'm mad. Hold on! Why are you it's benches not asymmetrical? Size? It's an asymmetrical room. You can eat my ass. So the benches are not asymmetrical. It's symmetrical. Symmetri it's not symmetrical. It's asymmetrical. You need to learn how words work. Bitch. Whatever. The benches are different sizes. Yeah, you know what? Your dick is tiny. Okay, Who so told as a you? bonus action, you mentally command them. Oh boy. Um, I think it's time for us all to die. I'm gonna. Uh. These are. I'm gonna call these. Oh god. I want to call them. Oh no. Holden, did you literally just kill your party? <laughs> yes. Um, okay. You know what? Yeah. Sure, you now have a small army of benches, some larger <laughs> than others. These are mediums, these are large, I'm going to call them. All right, I'd simply command them to attack them and give me their heads as revenge for what they've done to my... Uh... Benches don't have hands, they can't follow. They'll eat you. <laughs> They'll eat you. They, they got ri really big mouths. Does anime object give them mouths? Yes. <laughs> Okay, but it does the objects now. themselves... Here it does. The speed is 30. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I'm dead. Hmm. Oh my... Oh, wow. Uh, okay, here's how I'm gonna do this. Since you add... Okay, okay. No, no, give me give me one moment. I'm situating this. I'm situating this. We're making Why this happen. Why do you run with so many benches? Bitch, I didn't know he was gonna animate the benches. <laughs> what, a, what a stupid, crazy move. Why would I expect that? Harry, you're amazing. <laughs> Oh, thank you. <laughs> I mean, I did I did work with them and give them, you know, an animate object. But, like, I didn't, you know... Uh, no, you didn't. <laughs> didn't I? Yeah, I did. Maybe. Or did you just add that on your own? No, you. we talked about this. Oh, are you just trying to save me? <laughs> Maybe. Yeah. Okay. Um. So, it is your action to cast that spell. Mm -hmm. And then, yeah, you can command an object Um. with... A bonus action, I believe. But can you command all of them at once is the question. Uh, as a bonus action, you can mentally command sure. any creature you made with the spell. If the creature is within 500 feet, you can command any or all of them at the same time, issuing the same command to each. All right. If, if okay, you and you've, the already given them, you've already given them the command. Okay. Prior yeah, priority one would be uh, Zelfer and V. Okay. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> It was nice playing with you guys for so an hour tonight. On your okay, um, <laughs> but do they move? I can fix that. You command them. I'm gonna say they're gonna start going on your next turn. All right. Okay, so that makes it Bess's turn. Oh, whoops! It's Bess's turn. Me. Um, I'm gonna use my 
regular movement, and then I'd like to use Lesser Restoration on Six to get rid of his paralysis. Um, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 25. Uh, let me see if I have restoration that did my character sheet. DM, was that until the end of my turn? That was your last turn, yes. So now you are, as of the end of your turn, you are unparalyzed, yes. Oh, so he's not paralyzed okay. at all anymore? Correct. Okay. Thanks, um, Thank you, Bess. I'm sorry, I'm having a hard time navigating. You're good. Not a word. I'm worried about everything. You should be right now. I did hey, not. Hey, Blake. Uh, yeah. Blake, you see I'm the cameras? I'm worried right? about a lot of things as well. Do you. you want to see the noodle? Where is our enemy again? Cut you. Uh, here. And uh, also here. It's my lightsaber noodle. <laughs> and here. Here. And here, <laughs> and here, and here. <laughs> Where are you not numbered? <laughs> yeah, a little bit. I'm surprised Perry didn't lead off with this. I forgot about it. <laughs> no, I'm not should. surprised. Hold He's like 40 feet away from me, correct? Uh, from where you are here, he is 35. <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> Holden. <coughs> Holden. Yes. <laughs> Rob's uh, Rob's in your group. Or in your chat, I guess. Because he just sent me a message on Discord that said that lightsaber noodle is sexy as fuck. <sighs> Don't encourage it, Rob. <laughs> I would like to try to cast Banishment on him. Okay. Which is a uh, charisma saving throw. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Uh. Yes. Uh. Adamir, roll a roll a charisma save. Okay. No. You watch as like the outline of him of, of this creature starts to shift in and out, and then he stays. Shit. That was a really good save. Mm-hmm. He has a plus nine. Goddamn. Oh. Wow. <laughs> That's all I can do. Okay, Percival. Okay, hold on. Okay, Boomer. What? I'm not in control. Oh, that's you're correct. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> so we're gonna, we're, you're right. You're right. You're right. Uh, okay, I need this time. Ah, uh, you got him to say he'll slightly try. I, that, that's fucking me up. Um, Zelfer and Sam, choose a number between one and ten. I'm gonna, I would like to pitch the idea that it influenced his opinion a little bit on the fact that Zelfer looked uh, scared of him and specifically aimed a fireball not to hit him. Okay. But I still need Zelfer and Sam to pick a number between 1 and 10. 2. I was muted. Um, Rob's giving me encouragement on the noodle and I picked and you pick three. Three. Okay. One through ten. Two you guys five. both go two and three. <laughs> uh, Percival, roll two swings. That's <laughs> a nat 20 and a nat one. Wow. Okay. So you, your first swing carves into his shoulder, and it gets wedged in there so bad on your second, trying to get a second swing, and you have to, like, pull into, it out. Into whose shoulder? 
Into oh <laughs> into Adam ears, I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, both of them. Like, ah! Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I was like, fuck. <laughs> no, Where's the first one damage? carves into his shoulder so deeply that you have trouble pulling it back out, and on the second, you don't quite get a second swing. Um, but you are gonna take. Why didn't you roll any additional damage? He doesn't have a crit set up, I guess. Okay, so this, that's gonna Quiet. be eight nine. So you take 18, 20, it looks like 22 damage, Adamir. How do I set crit okay. up? And he is looking rough. Adamir is what not is looking What is crit good. damage? Crit damage is, um, you just add, you, you double the die of your attack, so you would do another another 3d6. So it should under crit damage should have a 3d6? Yeah. Um, you mean 8? What? 3d, oh wait. I thought my sword did eight. The three D eight plus four, that would be a lot. Yeah. Um, okay. So then Zelfer. Hmm. 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 Um Give me a sec. I'm making a general perception to see if I notice that the uh benches are moving at me. Uh, Just because I, I would be focused on him, I wouldn't be focused on the world around you me. You can self-impose that if you'd like, but I'm not giving you a DC. Oh, fine. Yeah. Yeah, no, I, I had a DC. It wasn't too high, but Zelfer was very one-minded. Like, yeah, he very... probably only has one brain. <laughs> yeah, but he's very sing like he focuses in on something. One track mind. Yeah, one track yeah. mind is the word I'm looking for. Um, well, I am almost out of spell slots. Eden, yikes! Stop that, forehead. Um, so. Om. Om. <laughs> yeah, Om's been doing that a lot. Yeah. It's fair. I now, said Om like 50 times playing Zelfer. You also haggled your way into a cheaper price for your room at the Gobble Inn um, while stroking um, your bottle of with an eyeball in it. Good. Yeah. <laughs> you also rolled I'm just ma I just magic missile. You're just going to magic missile him. Okay. Just going to magic missile So just right in front of you, just. Uh, doo -doo, doo -doo. Yeah. So you're going to take 11 damage out of here. Okay. You are at... Okay, he is very bad. Okay, Sam. I'm just going to swing. Two swings, that's and, 23 damage. And, 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 and. And I get to use this if I can find it. I'm, huge. I'm dumping them all. Dumping all 20? Yep. Okay. So that's, so that's a grand 35 total. plus 8. Wait, and here you can spend any money to black lens added to the damage. Uh, so every all so all your companions around you would also have to make that. Is it? Yeah, it's a fifteen foot cube. Alright, so what am I doing? You make a constitution saving throw. Yep, so if you fail the save Percy you take half of half of that damage, so you take ten damage it's if you fail. Percy, roll a con save, and Zelda. Same here, and same for Adamir. Oh, oh, <laughs> how much damage? Ten. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. And it's pushed ten feet away. From so me. no, no, Ad Adamir doesn't roll that because Adamir got hit. Admir just takes the fucking damage. Origi originating from the initial... Blood. Each creature originating from the initial target. Okay, so not you. Fine. Or not Admir. Yeah, yeah. He just takes full so damage. I... The other two take half. Okay. Right, how much do I take? You're... You take... 35 plus 8. Oh. Oh, am I pushed 10 uh, feet away now? Yeah. Do I take opportunity attacks? No. I don't think no. So. However... You... D <laughs> you, uh... You did land on this. <laughs> what is that? Uh, there are a bunch of... Uh, yeah, well, hold on. It hurts really bad. Graspy guys. So, yeah, a bunch of small gray clawed hands extend from the floor beneath you. You hear shrieking from below and they claw at your ankles. And landing on that, you, sir, are taking seven slashing damage. Ah, good. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and you're just pushed into that. 
Good, and if I move, I get attacked by a bench and a ghost. <laughs> Thanks, Jesse! <laughs> You're the one that put me here, And if here, I move, so I, I get attacked a... by a bench and a ghost. <laughs> oh, you couldn't have put me here. Quote, <laughs> add quote. And I, I, I am so dead. It's literally your fault that I'm here. And I literally, I, I wasn't here! <laughs> it's what you did before. Not what did session. I do? <laughs> you killed some hags. This guy wants revenge. He's dead for it. Okay, you can't prove that. <laughs> Six it was just turn? one hag. Oh, uh, it was just right. one hag. I just made her drink a bile. I didn't know it's gonna happen. Uh huh. Who knew? Um. Uh, all right. So, ten benches about to attack people. Um. Uh, that sounds crazy. Uh. Man, Man that's. I mean, if we take him out, they all the benches die, right? <laughs> See what I can do here. Uh, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50. Uh, I'm here no, now. Your What's your movement speed? 45. You just moved 50. Uh, yeah. Well, no, I was dashing, I assume. Yeah, okay, so you're gonna use I can your get action up... to dash. Yeah, because I can't get up there and attack him. There's, okay, there's okay, yeah, you can nothing. totally use your action to dash to get around, yeah. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll sit there. I, you were just counting casually 45, 50, I was like, whoa, whoa, whoa! <laughs> <laughs> like, what the fuck? He's like, 55, 60, 65, 70, he's like, <laughs> 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 Okay. Your legs are just growing continuously. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Adamir, at the start of your turn, the b benches move into action. <laughs> All right, 10, 15, say that 20, 25. And Zelfer are the main targets. Okay. Actually, they're all going to attack whoever they're closest to. We'll split it evenly. You evenly. already said. Okay. I um, am about to die, guys. It was nice knowing you. Because I'm assuming the hands are going to attack me, either, even if I'm unconscious, which is going to kill me. Didn't Holden tell you guys he didn't like this campaign anymore, anymore and he wanted it to be over? I knew that! Well, he, well. He, he told us that now. <laughs> yeah, now you if know. You die in a, okay, if you die so in a dream, he, he's fed you up, die guys. In real life? Okay, there's a lot here. Uh, Bess, <laughs> there are three benches attacking you. Cool. Uh, <laughs> let me just double check how much damage they do. Um, uh, okay. Oh, my. Uh, okay. Uh, Minecraft, go! So that is a hey, 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 22, a 21, and uh, and a 14 to hit you. Um, assuming I'm not wearing any armor, then yeah, that all hits. All hit? Shit. I'm pretty sure, right? Uh, well, what's I'm your AC? 90% sure. What's your AC? I'm trying to look now. I'm back. Uh, you if if you have armor, like you, you're not you're not complete. Sam's the only one without his armor. If you are in so, possession of your armor when you went to bed, you have armor on right now. Here's a question about that, Holden. By the way, mm -hmm. I don't think Bess would have gone to bed with her armor on. Yeah, you though. don't have to be wearing your armor. Okay, then yeah, then uh, the first two hit. First two hit. That's what I thought. So do I? Do I add my? Shield AC on top of my unarmored AC. Yes. Or do I? Okay. Because otherwise, it was like, do I just have to be at three AC? No, no. Um, so that's fifteen. Uh, okay, so you're taking seventeen bludgeoning damage as three benches Perfect. just slam into all your sides, Bess. And then the ghost is going to reach out, and that is a <laughs> that's gonna hit. Um. And reaches into your chest, and you're taking 10 necrotic damage as well. Great. Uh, Percival, only one bench is on you at the moment. That is a 19 to hit. Percival. What? One bench is on you, 19 to hit. Yeah, that hits. Sorry, my throat is starting to fucking kill uh, me. 13 bludgeoning damage Sorry, as it slams into I'm you. talking too much. 
Uh, Zelfer, there are three benches and a ghost. How much health do you have? Thirteen. <laughs> okay, well, let's just What's see. my AC? Well, well, the first bet, uh, you got hit for... What was a it? 10 and a... What was it? 13? 13 I, I don't sounds recall. Hydrate that. yourself. Uh, the first one's only a 9 to hit, Zelfer. The next Locked. one is what, a 16. Uh, I'm wait. Is it a bench hitting me? Yes. I'm not using shield. I'm waiting for the go. So one bench hit. Our bench is, our bench is forced. Forced damage. Bludgeoning. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> So one bench hits, and the next is a 19 from the bench. Yeah, and then the ghost is going to try to hit. It's only a 12. I for I shield it. Okay, so two benches. I see that as much more of a threat. Yeah. You might, I can only you use that actually live through once. these two hits. Let's see. Four, seven, ten, plus. That is 14 bludgeoning damage. Yeah, I'm unconscious. Okay. And I'm assuming the floor is going to eat me. Uh, I'll be right back again. Um, it will. Uh, since you... Uh, on your turn, yeah, you're going to take some de failed death saves if you don't get moved. Uh, also, so now Sam, one bench is trying to attack you. That's a nat 20. Whoa. Oh. So you're taking 16 bludgeoning damage. And then six, you got two benches attacking you. This is so fucking ridiculous. Um... Thanks for killing the party, bud. Six one a is a twenty-two. You to can't hit the die other. in a dream. The other is a fourteen. All right. Well, <laughs> the stupid. fourteen, the fourteen automatically hits uh, uh, our 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 big bad okay. over here because he misses. Yes. Okay, got you. So one bench from from your right side, it kind of like lunges at you in a very strange way, and you just kind of push it away, and it slams into Adamir for seven points of damage. Um. Let me check with Adam here. Okay, still up. Um, the other one is going to hit you from the other side as you do that for eight bludgeoning damage. Copy. I think that's everything. <laughs> Zelfer is down. Adamir, it is now your turn. <laughs> oh, that wasn't my turn? Okay. No, that, that, was a, <laughs> that was just your allies and people issued. You're going through the commands you issued. All right. Let's see. I'm Zelfer going to be Perry. Okay, I but yeah, I sent it to yes. the wrong account, so I was. Would you like that. to apologize for what you've done? No, fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> you apologize. <laughs> well, what, what what say you? I mean, I'm dying, man. <laughs> yeah, Zelda's uh, out, out of out of out of out of deserving. Character. Yeah, what's fuck up? You. Oh. Hey, let's have this guest in our D and D. Oh wait. Okay. Well, let's make him god. Hold on, I don't think this is balanced. <laughs> oh, it is. I promise. I don't think the it benches is... make this balance. No, 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 no. I promise. It sounds it for is. a dream. It sounds I know, I'm for a dream. Shit. No, I mean, so, yes. Many, I'm going... How many hundred health points? Hey, Holden. Yes. I'm going to cast Hold Person on these two. Okay. Uh, is that a... Level four, so it would be two people. And what kind of save is that? Uh, 17 wisdom. It's okay, both of your roll wisdom saves. Who, me? Uh... Sam and six. Boom. You're not holding me. Okay. <laughs> you, you cast it and they both... Well, all right. Yeah, you, you look at them and you're like, stop! And they both look at you like, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> you made Sam mad. Yeah, but you both felt the magical energy pierce you, but you're like, we're killing this fucker. I'm like, mad because like, Sam. <laughs> too, too mad. Like, I offered you peace and All right. Uh, let's see. Okay, give us one sec. Um. One moment. Bear with. I will not bear you. Please? I'll bear whatever you want to give me. The only person I want to see bear here is Jason. Appreciate it. Not gonna happen. What tonight. about tonight? Okay. Okay. 
Wait, Blake, is that just a bunch of quarters? I would drop this, but this no, is it's a uh, felt pads. So I'm, I'm not gonna furniture pads people. being found out where they were hidden. Ah, uh. <laughs> so now they're okay. hidden. Is better. that it then? That that be it. Okay, Bess, it's your turn. I would like to do healing word at level two, which is the lowest level I can do it at for Zel. For Zelfer? Yeah. Okay. 1d4 plus my spell casting abilities. That's uh. But at level two, that's 2d4, yeah? No, it's a second level spell. Healing word? Mass, or wait, yeah. Healing word, I think, is, isn't it? No, healing word's healing a level one. one. At level two, you oh. get 2d4. Okay, then I'll cast at level two, anyways. 2d4 plus four. I believe, right? Yes. Okay. <laughs> oh. Zelfer, you're technically up with six health. You're on the ground. <laughs> and you can feel claws just just batting at your back. The thing is, if there. I move, I die. I, I literally, I'm I'm, I'm dead. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> if I leave this area, I die. Anything else, Bess? Can I? Um... Would it be dumb of me to go try to help Zelfer up? No, nah, what? That's up to Bess. Yeah, you would know she'll... you take several opportunity attacks. I'm gonna stay where I'm at. Though. Okay. Sorry, Zelfer, you're on your own. Percival. Um. Secret, secrets. Yep, yep. I found these. Oh. Hmm? Go ahead. Oh, go ahead. No, go no, ahead. No, 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 no. Uh, you're, you're, you're a literal demon. Go ahead. I'm a literal demon. Oh, thank you. No, I believe he's on his last legs. Or she. It's really she. You have yet to use magic. It's your turn. And you're back in your head. And you hear just in the back, just like off in the distance, it almost sounds like. Have fun with it. Oh, I will. Okay. Was there something you wanted to tell me, or is that good? Oh, no, I was going to say, you have yet to use magic. Do this. Oh, yeah, okay. Nope, you're back in control, buddy. Okay, first of all, it is no. your turn. You are in control. Hey, Zelfer. <laughs> <laughs> I can do it, too. Watch this. Oh. Nine damage oh, from force? That was pussy shit. Yeah, it's fucking oof. How do you want to do this? Of course. Oh, on a fucking magic missile, I yeah. should have shattered. Oh, describe it to me, unless you want me to. <sighs> Holden, no, you didn't. What? What, Perry? You didn't do it, did you? Oh, don't worry. Well, no, I'm worried. Don't worry, I didn't. Okay! No, no, I didn't. Okay. Oh, but what if you did? So how do you want to do this, or do you want me to? Um... <laughs> just go ahead, I don't fucking know. Uh, I have an idea. My throat hurts so fucking much. Fucking so you guys watch as, from behind, Percival raises his hand. Hey, and energy emanates throughout his palm, and he unleashes it, doof, 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 and they all hit one in the back of his head, one in the back of his, and it, like, square in the back in his spine, and you hear a crack as it breaks his spine, and he falls back, and, and you can see, you can hear Percival and a laughter in your head, like, <laughs> more. Okay. What would you like to do? Oh. Uh. You feel yourself compelled to move forward. I'm moving forward then. How would you like to do this? Bitch, what? He's down. How would you like to slay him? You saying I'm down? Oh yeah. No. <laughs> oh. I didn't get to finish them off. Um. You're, you you hear him kind of again. murmuring to himself. I didn't get to. No, I'm not done. I'm gonna lean down really close into his face. 
and just I spit in your lightly... face in response. You what? I'm gonna spit in your face in response. Can I shield that? No. <laughs> one 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 point saliva damage. <laughs> one point gross damage. Yeah. It's a it's a bloody spit. Just on your cheek. Get AIDS. Oh fuck, dude. I'm gonna lean down really. You will take one d ten AIDS damage at the beginning of your turn forever now. (laughs) Um, let's see. I'm trying to think back to the fucking our first fight we had with them. Okay, I'm gonna lean down and put my blade. Uh, How are they laying? Is it on their back? Yeah. All right. The tip of the blade on their sternum. And I'm going to start pushing down. And each time I push down, I'm going to say staircase one. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to push down farther and go staircase two. And after you say that. All right, I'm screaming hysterically. And, and and as he's pushing into you, in the midst of your screams, you say. To hell with you. And you start to feel the room warp around you, Percy, as you push deeper and deeper. Staircase three. <laughs> and the benches begin to fade. And Zelfer. You feel the hand start to claw at you again because you definitely would have fucking literally died the next turn. <laughs> Let's see. You, you, would I have? Uh, one no. bench would be a nat 20. The next bench would be a uh, oh, 21. Yeah, yeah. The hands uh, at the ground would have dealt seven damage. Uh, yeah, would, you they have have... Me, would they have beaten me to actual death? Like, yes. As I was on... Okay, so yeah, I was dead. Yes, you would have literally died. But you feel the hands beneath you start to fade away. The room warps as if it's in the, a giant tornado and things start to spiral around and Percy's just sitting there, staircase four and pushing deeper and deeper as this creature's yelling, ah, to hell with you! And then poof, it's all gone. Everything fades to black. And then Damn, you're lucky so there really you're gonna steal the thunder with a fucking magic <laughs> missile? Everything fades to black. You start to hear screams and distant distant cries and fire and you, it feels like you're literally being sent through hell, and then all at once, <gasps> you all wake up in the middle of the night, back in your rooms. And, and, and we take our long crest, right? <laughs> <laughs> yes, you could all take your long crest now, except Zelfer, when you wake up, you as you were knocked unconscious, you will have one level of exhaustion. But you'll get your spells back and everything. You'll have your long rest, but one level of exhaustion. I can fix that. So, you all wake up back in your rooms. The hellish nightmare you were just going through has disappeared. I roll over and go and Sam try to sleep some more. What time it is. Looking outside, oh. it's still pitch black. It's probably the middle of the night. But as you're all kind I'm of just like... I'm my tent and I'm crawling in it. I feel yeah. safe. <laughs> in your room. You guys kind of look in around. The wounds you suffered in the dream, while not... Like, uh, from when the ceiling collapsed on top of you. Not fully there. It's not like you're bludgeoned and bleeding to death. Zelfer, you're, you don't have scratches all over you. But you can see, like, faint red lines. As if it were an old wound that was healing for many weeks. Any Are we in separate you rooms? You're all in separate rooms. Okay. Yeah. Do I know where Six's room is? Probably right next door. <laughs> we would probably know. Uh, before we move on, though, uh, Perry, thank you so much for joining us, dude. No, thank you guys. This is very. Hey, 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 Perry, Perry, sorry, quick. we had to slaughter you, sir. <laughs> how, how many hundreds of health did you have? Way too much. We... <laughs> I gave him um, a lot. Actually, a lot. no, 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 yeah, no, 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 no. Started... Don't, don't, don't. No, 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 no. Don't tell okay, them. Okay. Don't tell them. Okay. I will I tell them what I, I want to tell them. I promise. You are not right. the number. Hold on. Hold on. Can you, can Perry, you tell your them roommate? About the thing, I will can go and tell do them the fucking math. You really want me? I'm not telling you the number. It was a ridiculous number, and you'd be mad. I had to balance it for you guys. <laughs> yeah, you guys hit me hard. Don't worry. You Perry, guys, just Perry. tell your roommate, and I'll ask him. All right. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Perry really wants me I'll to tell you guys. Holden's so. wishes. Perry very much wants me to tell you guys. Uh, you could have beaten him even worse because you were in a dream. He's not we the only can... one who can do crazy dream stuff. It was your dreams. Oh. Right. If you guys had figured it out, anything. you could have dropped the ceiling on me. I would have turned you into a Perry bench. and I were talking about this fight beforehand, <laughs> and we basically said if they figure out that it's a dream and they can do dream bullshit too, the fight's over. Absolutely over. Right. I figured we were under the rules of, uh, yeah. 
No, Honestly, if I was God. if I was here for more than an hour, I probably would have tried some bullshit. Yeah, and you probably would have <laughs> done some bullshit. Yeah. <laughs> because but because that's how I am as a person, but I wasn't because my job is Yeah, no, that great. sucks. But I, yeah. I don't I don't have all that shit in, <laughs> yeah. in um, my in my uh, in my I go thing. I go to. Uh, but before we move on, Perry, if you want to stick around, yep. cool. While we while while we wrap up, up to you, we'll probably go another. I imagine, fifteen twenty minutes. I'm not sure, but uh, up to you, buddy. Uh, that's minutes. that's all right. Oh, th thank you, thank you guys. That was very fun. Oh, thank you, Perry. Uh, come come to Perkins. I mean, I'll give it a shot. Uh, <laughs> I'll be in all Perkins right. in January. Right. Well, I'm I'm gonna hop off then. You guys have fun. Yep. Bye bye. <laughs> See you soon. Good night, bud. I go to Six's room. Yes, you do. Zelfer. You know it's <laughs> Zelfer. Who else would knock like that? Um, how'd you know it was me? Uh, the knocking. Can I sleep on your floor? There's, there's already somebody on the floor. Who? Uh, Bess. Is she on your floor? She wanted the floor. Not my choice. You can have the bed. Are you gonna Come hold me? I was gonna take the floor. I think I only one of us is taking the bed, bud. Um, you wanna go on a walk? Sure. You would gauge okay. it's probably two or three in the morning. I'm okay with uh, that. I wanna talk to him. You can still, okay. if you wanna take a short walk, you can still get your long rest benefits and everything. I'm taking All a right. point of exhaustion regardless. Yeah, regardless, so. you, you, yeah, you nearly died. You literally, one more turn, you would have been dead, dead. Yeah. I start walking with him. All right. Mr. Six, that was yes, entirely okay. too real. Uh, yeah, it, uh, um, it seemed pretty real at the time. I'm going to be honest with you, Mr. Six. I am not particularly fond of the idea of dying. I know you were uh, you were pretty scared about that Sphinx thing way back. And if another event happens where in your co our company where I get that close to death again, I don't know how long much longer I will be. And that's just I I don't want to die. And before I joined this group, I never had this close to dying, and I feel as though it happens every. Other week. <laughs> it is a dangerous job we uh we, we we do. Correct, and um I don't believe I was fully aware of that. No, well this... hopefully once we get back to the castle and Direwood and you're the uh what was it? Mage? Or of the uh, of the realm. Yes. Uh hopefully quite a bit less deadly adventures ahead. Yeah, because I feel as though another six seconds had passed, I would have died. That's pretty um, interesting math, Zelfer. It's what they, I have what they call a big brain. Ah. I do big brain things. I see. All right. Well. But um, I do not want to die, and I will do whatever it takes not to have that something that I have to deal with. I understand that. That's a fair assessment. I, right, I understand. Um, let us go back to sleep. You can have the bed. I'll go to my own room. I just wanted to talk. I uh, I clap you on the back as we we walk back to the to the room. And, say, I, uh, and it hurts a little almost, bit as the scratches. I, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I also almost fall over because six is way stronger than me. Oh. Uh, <laughs> like you I fight say, with your hands. I fight with. Oh, about a hundred feet of distance. <laughs> I say, um, I really hope we uh, we don't have to go back there again. I really hope to, I don't die. To that place. Because that seems I like, hope... um, I don't know if it can get more negative. All right, I understand. Well, you have been fun. Um, don't make, don't impregnate the rat. And I shut my door after that sentence. <laughs> I go back to bed. <laughs> you go back to bed or you go back to bed? <laughs> <laughs> oh. And the morning comes. <laughs> it's Dota 6. Right. <laughs>
right, right, right. So, you guys awake the next morning, uh, battered and bruised. But again, it's strange. It's as if you suffered all of those wounds, but weeks ago, and they've had time to heal over. But you can still feel just the soreness from them. Uh, as you awake, it's a nice day. The sun is shining. You can hear birds chirping. It's really lovely. And you wake up maybe a little later than usual. Instead of at 6 a.m., it's 7 or 8. But you got some time still. So, you guys are in the upper floor of this tavern. Sam oh, I haven't immediately seen this. leaves and Dude, goes to the... I haven't seen this map before. Hold on, this is actually pretty dope. Yeah, I did a lot of work on it. <laughs> it's fucking dope. Thank you. Well. Look at that. Oh, you have It's a casino. I like yeah. this part. And there would be a and lot I like less this of part. this. I like this These part. These people wouldn't I be really here. like that part. Those people might be there. Um, that's a cool part. Look at all those robot that's heads. That's weird. The real part. Um, Why are there part, robot heads everywhere? There's a triangle. Uh, are you done? Yeah. Okay. Hey. So, you guys like Yes? Yes. I like this part, and this part, and this part. <laughs> And I assume you all convene to some degree over no. at... No? No, nope, Sam goes yes. straight to the armor smith. Sam oh. is going right to the smith. Okay, well, the rest of you awaken... Mm -mm, not doing that shit again. Yep. I Somewhat... sit the table away from everyone else. Okay. Sit by myself, kind of. For the first time, if... looking like he's thinking. I don't know if you know just how untrusting you made Sam. It's the one night he spent without his armor. A I bunch of bullshit happened. Maybe you... not you, Zofer. The DM. The one night I spent without my armor and a bunch of bullshit. Happened. Nope. Uh, Zofer, as you sit down at a table, the uh, the goblin who you know runs the Gobble Inn, um, kind of calls over to you. Hey there, it's a lot of noise from your room last night. Is it, you okay? What? <laughs> <laughs> I said, are you are you okay? You, you make a lot of noise in your room. You're ah, about to bump um, and pounding. You good? Oh, oh, that was, that, was that one and that one. I point up best in the six. Ah, that's lovers. I like okay, okay. Well, <laughs> if you need any breakfast, just let me know. They, uh, well, six needs a cigarette or two, if you know what I mean. <laughs> I was going to order eggs until now. <laughs> I, I just start look, go back and start just staring at the table. Not smiling, just staring at it. Okay. Well, you ordered the room's breakfast on the house, so uh, if you guys want anything, just let me know. Uh, uh yeah, Percival, breakfast, breakfast would be great. Percival's gonna walk up to the bar, hmm? ask for tea. You get some tea. Just throw it around. Any any the basic door. drinks, any basic food, it is, it is you, part do, of the do, deal with the room. Do you have some bread that has been heated up? Uh, I, I could heat up some bread. Please do. Okay. No flavor, just yeah. bland bread. Bland <laughs> uh, bread. Bland burned bread. Bland no, burned bread. Bland burned bread. Bland burned bread. Bland burned bread. Bland burned bread. You, bland burned bread. If you heat it up, I'm, I'm, I will break something. Well, you, you want it, you said you wanted to heat it up. What do you want? Well, okay, do you have a grill? I, I, have, I have fire, yeah. Well, do you have a pan or a metal thing yeah. you put over the fire? Yeah. Well, you heat up the pan, yeah. put a little bit of butter on the bread, yeah. put it there for about maybe 15 seconds, yeah. and, then flip it, and then bring it to me. Okay. The <laughs> I gotta go take some fucking meds. I uh, need to wrap up. Okay. So, All right, buddy. You guys have your breakfast, Sam. Um, you're going to retrieve your armor. <laughs> yep. Can I go see if he's done with it? He, you get there. He said he told you the twenty second he'd be done. He is not done. No. What day is it? Uh, let me pull up my. Camera. I don't. I thought he said like in a day. No, you left your sword and armor to be examined. And he told you he was very unfamiliar with it, and it would take some time. Um, hmm. it is I should the... probably return the sword then. What do you mean? Because I was using my sword in that fight. Yeah. 
but I can summon the sword, so I mean, I might yes. as well just hand it I back. I thought I left my sword, the royal one. You... Let's see here. <sighs> Percy, you got your thoughts? I don't have any notes about that. I don't think you did. I don't have any notes about that. Alright, that's fine. Blue. So, uh, would you like? He, he tells you he'll gladly give it back. It's yours, but he's he has he hasn't really cracked it yet. No, no, it's fine. I just had a really, really, really rough night without it. Uh, here's my sword back. He's really confused when you give him the sword. He's like, "What? Wait, I thought you, what? <laughs> Wait, where did you?" As he's holding it, I summon it back in. He he got he kind of gives a look like ah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I, this came in real handy last night. I'm glad I could summon this. I just hand it back. He gives though. a knowing nod. So, but you retrieve your armor. Or are you gonna keep it with no. him? Okay. So your sword. I ask him how many more days, so that I, I got a rough estimate of uh, what day. It is. Today is the mm, 18th. <laughs> so four days. It is the 18th of Xerxesa. On the 22nd of the season, you will get it back. Okay, so, Six, what's up with you, man? <laughs> what do you mean? Flap, 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 flap. Six, 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 six seven, eight. Chocolate darts. Uh, yeah, six I mean, you know. Just, 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 just saying hey. Shut the fuck up. So. You guys have your breakfast, Sam. You go and check on your weapons and armor. Um, what would you guys like to do? You would estimate Beth, did you, you say have... hi to the bear? <laughs> Beth? I'll, I'll go eat. I could not hear it if, if someone was oh. speaking. Did you say hi to the bear? I did not. Should we? Should we? Okay. Oh, I don't usually You like to say hi to bears. I don't know. It's fine. The bear is just napping on its cushions. <laughs> All right. I'll go look at the bear. Sure. You look it's a nice bear. bear. It is a big, healthy, fuzzy-looking brown bear. Fuzzy-looking. <laughs> is it pettable? <laughs> Looks very pettable. I pet the bear. You start petting it, and you get caught off guard for a moment when it jerks its head up and looks at you. And it mauls your arm. And kind of like... <laughs> and then lays its head back it's down. It's a bear, and not a that's a good bear impression. I'm gonna keep on petting it. Yeah, it lets you get pets. <laughs> Give pets. It is enjoying the pets. It seems to be a very well trained bear. Dude, Sadie is hunting the fucking centipede on the couch where I'm sitting. Oh! That's, I'm sorry. So you guys estimate you have Run. about an hour before you need to be at the Grand Hall for your speeches. Um. Um. All right. Well, I just sit. By myself, looking at the table and twiddling sure. my thumbs. Sure. Sam goes back and eats yeah. beforehand. You all have your breakfast. Sure you have the pets. you have some morning tea, drink, whatever you'd like. A bear is pet. I'm gonna grab another cup of tea and sit down across from Zelfer. I'll glance up in front of him. I'll look at it. I'll put my finger in it. Does it hurt? Um, normally you're supposed to drink it. <laughs> is it hot? Does it burn my <laughs> finger? <laughs> Hold it. Yes. What? Yes. He burned yes. my finger. I mean, a little bit, yeah. Ah. It's fairly hot. Hmm. It's not like scorching. Is that what they gave uh, Miss Beth to make her vibrate? No, 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 no. That was a different kind of leaf juice. <laughs> that was, was also... That was that beet was, uh, juice. This is leaf juice. That was also a different party member. <laughs> No, I know what? they're talking about the breakfast tea in the in the tavern underground. Ah, uh, no, six made her vibrate. Hey, we get it. Six <laughs> fucked. Jeez, <laughs> we get it. You're all shipping. We get it. I kind of look at it. I appreciate the gesture. Soothes my throat. Might be able to soothe your mind. Who knows? Do I dump it on my head? Will you dump you know, it down your throat? I'm gonna assume that you, as a, a humanoid, 
say you have a, a row of stats. <laughs> and if intelligence was on there, per se, it would probably be one of the higher ones. So I'm going to let you figure that one out. <laughs> As I sip from my cup, demonstrating exactly how to fucking do it. <laughs> I take a sip. It's good. It's not amazing, but it's good. It's so amazing. Morning tea. <laughs> amazing. Honestly, you know what? No, even though it's like it's it's some basic morning tea, it's probably quite good compared to what you've experienced in Direwood. <laughs> Five six. Mm. Mr. Percy. Do you think I'm gonna die with you guys? Um Maybe. I don't know. I think eventually all of us are gonna die with who is Well I mean I've been with you guys for a few weeks, and, um, on multiple occasions, I have almost died. Um. One occasion was also when you stabbed me in the chest. That was an accident. We don't need to talk about that. You also swung at me a few times last night. Also not me. I mean, I'm pretty sure I, it was you. I mean, I never saw you um, leave. I, I stopped. I stopped swinging at you because you specifically aimed a fireball away from me. So that was pretty cool of you. So. No, that hurt me too. <laughs> yeah, but I didn't. I didn't. So did the hit, benches. So. so many benches. Yeah, the benches were kind of fucked. You I'll, I'll give you the that. The goblin behind the counter, like listening to you guys and looking, and like looking very confused. And that's when. Mr. Oh, it's the Sa goblin. Long story. Do I see him Sounds paying like attention? It. Yeah. And that's when Six tied her up, and man, was it ridiculous. Uh, he seems more. <laughs> not... I hold what, up the cup and I look at the goblin and go, I cannot believe how hard I climaxed last night. Oh my god. <laughs> the goblin's like leaning over the counter, and they're like, oh. <laughs> You see, Mr. Six is really good with his hands and his feet, surprisingly. And his head. <laughs> I went to an arcane college with a guy who could animate benches to be buff orcs. And let me tell you. Um. You guys had a different dream than I did, I think. <laughs> the goblin here came in. Oh, Goes back to whatever he was doing. Oh, no big orcs at, for the goblin. At man. this point. You hear a bong, 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 a loud bell that echoes throughout probably the entire city. It's loud. And everybody in, in the tavern, the few, there's maybe a half dozen patrons in here having breakfast. They all, all the chatter stops. It's quiet and everybody kind of looks up expectantly. And you hear a fairly familiar voice go, hey, uh, hey everyone, uh, good morning. So the restorative court of Direwood will be holding a grand assembly in the grand hall in uh, about an hour all are welcome to attend and encouraged to attend see you there thank you have a good There's morning not 11 this, people in this, and this, this voice echoes throughout the tavern and throughout you imagine the whole city i take another sip because you put me twice oh there's 12 so there is a dozen people i i take another sip of tea and i look at the goblin and go huh oh, that's us that's you that's yeah us. A big magic guy's talking about you. Um, should that I, is what I'm going with. This I guess I gotta go. All right, all right, everybody, scram! We're closing down. Everyone, go to the assembly hall. We're gonna, we're gonna close I, down for the assembly. Uh, look at Percival. I use minor illusion to imitate the exact same bell, the dung, the dinging noise. Not nearly as loud, but it dong, 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 and everyone in the tavern again shuts up and quietly, like expectantly, looks around. <laughs> I think it was a malfunction in your system. <laughs> That's kind of weird. Usually he talks after he does that. Interesting. Uh, you might want to have, have a word with This is NPR. <laughs> weird. Maybe they just accidentally rang the bell again. That's an actual bell at the Grand Hall. I don't know. Oh, is it? Yeah, yeah, yeah no, You know what? Magic. I bet it's about to ring again. <laughs> that would be weird. Unless he's going to speak. How would you know that? I look at six <laughs> as he's looking around. I look back to the man and go, I think he's crazy. Too much sex. Uh, uh, <laughs> and then he uses minor illusion. I leave. 
And people start to file out. After, like, a few moments of nothing being said for the second bell, people are like, oh, whatever. People start to file out and... Um, the second, the second people stand up, I make the noise again. Dun, 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 dun. And everybody, huh? Like looks up and around. I was right. I was right. And the goblin's like, "How did you know? What? Yes, you must know him pretty well. That's, huh? Very cool. Why isn't he talking? This is really weird. I don't oh. like maybe he just likes ringing the bell." Uh, he's not the one who rings the bell. He tells them when to ring a bell, and they run up to the top, and they go... Maybe yeah, yeah. he just likes telling people to run up and down. Yeah, that bell. sounds like something he'd do. He's pretty funny. Well, anyway, we're closing. We're closing. Get out of here. Uh, you guys, you know, we got a meeting. Can I take okay. this teacup? And people are filing out. Oh, it's my teacup. Can are I have you, it? Are you going to pay for it? How much is it? Uh, it's just a fucking two copper. A copper and a half. Two copper. <laughs> I gave you a discount on the room, weird eyeball man. I don't wanna. I'm not doing this again. I can make it float. The cup? Yes. Make it do a little dance in the air, and then and then one copper. I cast Mage Hand and make it dance in the air. And then <laughs> never seen a cup dance. Yeah, yeah. Here, give, give me the copper. I give him a copper. The teacup's yours. You have a teacup. Wait, I... Hey, Mr. Goblin. Yeah. Did you know that Joe is also speaking? Who's Joe? See, Holden knows exactly what you're doing, but the goblin. <laughs> Are you inventing Joe Mama in my D and D world? Are you inventing Joe Mama in my D and D universe Joe right now? Mama. I'm about to fucking slaughter. Slitzy comes, forms physically in the hall and starts slaughtering hey, uh, Percival. He's gone. <laughs> hey, uh, hey, Yuri's also gonna be there. Wait, who's your? Who, you guys have a lot of friends. You're retarded. Retarded. I've never oh. heard of that family. Hey, hey, it looks like you got a butt pour on your forehead. You got what? You you got a butt pour right there on your forehead. A butt pour? Where? On my, on my fore- He starts patting his forehead. What are you talking- What's a butt for? A, a butt for pooping, silly. Huh. What a fucking scream. I need to go to bed. Everyone get, go to get bed. out of my tower! Go to the fucking meeting! Do I have to? By now, all the rest of the tavern, all the, everyone else in the tavern has left and seems to be up going to the Grand Hall. I look, do I have to go? Well, you don't have to, but it's highly encouraged, and if it's your fucking meeting... Uh, Zelfer, I think we have to go. Oh. Yeah. Are you sure? I think we, I, if I, anyone, have to go. Yeah, we're given the, we're given the speech. Are you, are you guys, so you guys are the rest, the court of, court of, uh, the court Yes. Direwood. Yeah, that one. We are the car desires. Oh, good fucking luck. I'm not gonna be helping you. All right, get 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 out. Go. Hurtful. Well, you're a bunch of shenanigan uh, doers. That's what you are. What did I do? We, did, we yeah. like harmless jokes. Making making bells ring and cups dance and well the bells. Whoa! Ring, you you know. asked me to make the cup dance. Yeah, I made the cup dance. Yeah, that's that me. In fact, you paid him for it. I did. Yeah, you're right. Oh, get out of here! Stop correcting me. I don't like you. You're, 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 I'm okay. sorry. I love you. Wait, Bye. before you go, did you want another night in the room? Yes. All right. Yes. All right. It's 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 three gold for everyone. I request four more nights. I want four more nights. Uh, four four nights is three gold a night. I tell you, what, uh, no, I don't like you. So. All right. Can Percy just say that he's going with people? Yes, you can. You can head to the ground. Okay. Are you gonna right, pay really for to go four more nights as well? Out. Yeah. Sure. Okay. So it's twelve gold, and you have a room for four nights. It comes with dinner and breakfast. Okay. Thanks. Bye. Okay. And you start heading Love to you. the ground hall. Um. I look at the guy. I sit down in front of him. Um, what discount did I get? You you paid two gold, five silver. Okay. I can't fix that. I'm a little broke. So it would be, ten, <laughs> it would be ten gold total for you instead, if you convinced him to let you continue that rate. Um, I don't have ten gold. <laughs> uh, Has someone been paying for me? No, you paid the first night. Yes, Alfred. No, did I? I didn't I have mean, that I guess, much. I guess six is going to be. Paid. Okay, you took okay. I got gotcha. you. Okay, because I have two gold. Um, if I look at him, I sit down in front of him. I look at him, I look at him dead in the eyes. Huh? I apologize for this. Uh, will this make up for it? I I pull up the golden necklace that I stole a while back. Oh. Will this make up for all the transgressions and us kind of bothering you and well, put us back on your good side? Well, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That'll. Uh, he he looks at it. He doesn't fucking know what he's doing. Uh, yeah, you know, that's that's more than generous. Uh, 
That'll cover all the you, you take a gold back. Yeah, yeah, that'll cover you all got rooms for four nights. Four nights, dinner, breakfast, I'll take <laughs> and he puts it on, he's wearing the gold necklace now. <laughs> you look absolutely phenomenal. I Someone say breathtaking. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I apologize again. You guys got four nights. Dinner and breakfast. I smile, I smile at him and stand up and head out. Okay. Alright. Uh, well okay. So you guys start to make your way. Yeah. We'll be wrapping up in just a moment here, but you guys start to make your way to the Grand Hall. And you can see, you know, the streets are usually busy. It's early in the morning, maybe 8-ish a.m. But there's a fair amount of people. Like, you join a small crowd heading toward the Grand Hall. And as the further, you, the closer you get to the Grand Hall, the bigger the crowd becomes. And by the time you reach the Grand Hall, when you're maybe 100 feet from the entrance, there's, like, people are funneling in. Like, there's a, you know, there's hundreds of people here funneling into the Grand Hall. And you can kind of hear people whispering like, man, he doesn't normally, it's only, it's usually important when he does this. Like, like, you get the idea that announcements like this aren't made unless it's quite important, just from general ah. chatter around you. So, though you didn't secure a, an audience with the Pathfinder, it seems you've definitely caught their attention. And they've called a large assembly for you to speak in front of. And you're looking at the hundreds of people you're going to be speaking in front of. Some of you who maybe are not as charismatic, you might get a little butterfly in the stomach at the idea of talking in front of this many people. And yep. uh, you guys make your way in eventually. Cool. And, and there's just – the Grand Hall is filled with chatter. It's completely oh, yeah. lit. Dozens of guards. It looks very official. And as you walk, you walk in, actually, um, the – the Inquisitor, the one who made the announcement, says, Ah, welcome back. Uh, you go to that map? Uh, no, because we're about to wrap up. Um, he says, Hey, glad you could make it. Uh, we got some chairs set up for you guys. Uh, do you want some... How do you want it to set up? We'll set it up however you like. We'll, we'll have chairs, desks. You can sit at one big table. We can have a bunch of tables for you. It's however you like. We put the chairs upside podiums. down. You can have can we have bunk chairs. Table. Can we have bunk tables? It's whatever you want. It's your assembly, man. Like, hey, whatever. Huh? You know what? It's all good. You are a phenomenal, man. Thank you. I do my best. Well, anyway, um, this is a really big turnout, I'll be honest. Uh, good luck. There's, a, there's at least seven people here, maybe more. Uh, probably <laughs> half the city here. Uh, anyway, um, and he leads you. He kind of like people move out of the way for this guy, and he leads you through the crowd and up to the up to the uh, podium, the center does, stage area. He, he, does he have a nice butt? Make a perception check. Phenomenal. Okay. He uh yeah. he leads you up. You, this, this place is packed, and he says, uh, "You guys start in 15 minutes, and if uh, whenever you'd like to begin, after then, go right ahead. Um, good luck, and I wish you well. I wish you the best. You can't. It's hard really? to tell through his cloaks, but there's something there. He might mm -hmm. have a nice butt. Hard to say. I could marry into them, and then boom, Direwood and Priest are connected. Yeah, but he wishes you well." He I shake you. his hands yeah. and tell him good luck. And as you shake, as you shake his hand, he he, he 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 puts his hand on yours. So you got that like double, you know, holding hands. He's like, thank you, thank you. I won't need it, but you will anyway. Go on, go on. Hi, Beam. And you guys are ex escorted to the to the center stage. All eyes are on you. Extorted. Extorted. Yep. To the center stage. All eyes are on you. People are still murmuring as you know. They, there's a general consensus that they, this hasn't started yet, but it will soon. And a lot of people are looking at you guys and whispering and talking. And um, we will pick up next time. Bean on cam. you guys starting your speeches. Bean cam. All right.